Chris wants to. Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, thank you. Hey, Olu Bakata, Olu Bakata, look at you everywhere bubbling. Eh? You need to tell me the secret. Even your workers, they are all on point. Hmm. My brother, it's just God. It's God. But <coughs> I'll tell you the secret. I make sure I recruit the best hands, the best brains. Then I treat them well. I give them good accommodation. I provide transportation. And I pay them well. Why would they not perform? That's super nice. <laughs> and that reminds me, what about your Buddha branch? 100% ready. Wow. Completed. Hey! It's ready. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> no. No. Hundred percent. I'm just waiting for the Minister for Tourism to give me a date for the commission. Sharp, sharp, yeah. sharp, sharp. Congratulations, congratulations, bro. Congratulations. <laughs> the seventh branch in this country. I'll tell you. What God cannot do does not exist. <laughs> I trust you. Relation, relation. Hey! One Okay, you're still washing the car. You know I'm going out. So my boss says, oh. Okay, sir. I'm almost done, sir. Onye kankene. Ake uchi owa ke ebo. Onye kankene. Owa na ezi o. Wi. Izu o. Onye ogazi. Eh. Onye nwamba. Odogu. Hey. I was uh, on my way from Adazi when you called. Adazi? Yes. My maternal home. Today is the New Year festival. Oh, it's today. Yes. Oh, it was a colorful event. Very wonderful, eh? So much to eat and drink. In fact, I even came back with a fowl. As what they are Yes, a friend of mine from Adazi invited me for some event, but um, I wasn't prepared for it. Mm -hmm. Next year is another year. Yes, mm -hmm. you are correct. Odogu, I ban on a camel god. Oh, yes, you come again. Atokalia! <laughs> thank you, thank you, mm. thank you. The cheese rub. I sent for you to advise me on a very important matter. I don't know why you and other the cheer are slow. In organizing an election for a new Igwe Far community. It's the sole reason I relocated to this village. And I have long time made my intentions known to all of you. Why is it not being taken seriously? Or do you want our community to continue without a leader? Um, no, 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 Ako. Mm -mm. No. See, <clears throat> we cannot. Eh? We are incomplete without an Iwe. It's been two years since our Iwe died. And we are long overdue for a new one. So why did they leave? I think everything depends on you. If you move our people, they will move. Mm. See, um, for now, Onowu and his inner circle are the ones calling the shots in the community. We should not be so. I don't trust Ono. That's why I always rely on you. So what should I do? Mm. I think um, you should uh, organize a meeting, call a declaration party. Give them enough food and drinks. Yeah? Something for their pockets. At that party, declare your intentions. If I may know, Sounds good. It is a good idea. Because once it is done, 
I will now mount pressure on you know to uh, convene a meeting of Ndichi where we will now formally adopt you as the ego designate. Okay. And once I'm recognized as an Igwe designate, I will now put together the coronation. As well. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds good. Um, when do you think I can host this year? Whenever you're ready. I want it immediately, like tomorrow. Uh, mm -mm. Um, let it be on Saturday, uh, three days from now. So that I will have time to go and meet all the Ichies. Hmm? Hmm. So I cannot have time to organize the food, the drinks, and exactly. Uh, fresh from wine and uh, stout from the Ichie. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> you see, that's why I always rely on you. <laughs> uh, uh, you see, um, your father and my father were very good friends. Etua. Hmm? Hmm? And uh, it is good that we continue this relationship in their honor. Well spoken. <laughs> Well spoken. Yes. Mm. Okay. Uh, so, um, Ako, I will take my leave. Let me now go and start seeing them. Very important. Mm. I, uh, my regards to your family. I will. I will give. I will. Mm. And uh... Ako. <laughs> oh, you're full. Oh, you full, eh? Okay, for what? Ato Umadas and a fat of a ham, but they took a gas dab. I need you to buy these things today. I'm hosting a meeting of Ndichie and some elders tomorrow to formally declare my intention to become the Igwe of this town. I want you to buy those things and cook the meal specially and personally because I'm a Nisi. Eh? <laughs> I will be the Igwe Akokalia. <laughs> Of whom dim and you, Ugeze Ugoma Akokalia, if I didn't ma. But sweetheart, this money won't be enough to buy all these items. Things are very costly these days. Ugoma, this money will be enough. You will even bring back change. Can you imagine? Maybe you will go to the market yourself. Then will you realize that things are very expensive? Wait, why do you men keep thinking that we women are always short changing you people? But let's. Ugoma, I don't want to get into argument with you this morning. Huh? Take your driver, go to the market before it gets more crowded. And take her daughter with you so that she will start learning how to do things and how to become a princess. Beyond the kid that rehearsed, but if I had to go. Okay, Kibo. Add some mangala. Bags of. You know what? I would just buy exactly how your money is worth. Nothing more, nothing less. <laughs> You are arguing with me now. In my next life, I will never marry a stingy man. Yes, I'm a stingy, but I'm a good man. Eh? You are troubling me over this now, but immediately you become a crazy. Who wants you to make a name on you? A name on you? You are going to say, Go back to your parents. You know how you came here. Are you looking to say, You are here. No, you are not. You are not. Yes, I'm stingy, but I don't know what I'm saying. Ah, you are going to say, Ah, you are going to say, your parents know I take good care of you. It's okay, maybe I'm. 
Anyway, I'll be coming you with very shortly. If I remember. Daddy! Daddy, daddy, daddy! Daddy! Is it true that you, you told mom that I should go with her to the market? What about? Daddy! Hey, you want to turn me into a village girl? I'm tired of this village thing. I want to go back to Lagos. To do what in Lagos? To stay! Is your father or mother in Lagos? I don't need my father or my mother to be in Lagos if I can live there. Really? Yes. <laughs> Your mates are not doing their youth service. Oh no. You're here. Because you couldn't pass your degree exams. Now you are looking for an opportunity to go to Lagos to continue to gallivant with those your lousy friends. This is my vote. This is my vote. It's missing scripts. It is blockheads like you that their scripts are declared as missing. You should be reading for exams now so you can pass. Huh? Let me warn you. This will be the last time I'll pay for somebody to write the exam for you. In fact, I have been an irresponsible father to have somebody sit for exam for you. Huh? That is not fair. It's not fair. You said to be now, brother. You left me here to rot. I want to drive our brother as well. And it's kind of that I want to go. Enough of this nonsense. Now, go to the market with your mom and buy those things for my meeting. And let me warn you, let this be the first and last I'll see you wear this nonsense. If I do, I will fear it off your body. You want to go to Canada so that you will disappear from there. Get out of here. I don't like what people are doing to me in this house. I'll back my lord and leave. It's okay. Then. I don't like what people are doing. If I see you wear this nonsense again, I'll tear it off your, off your body. In fact, I need to do, do a DNA of you. If I have my blood. Can I miss it? Yes, I'll be going to the village next month. Yes, I want to give my mother a befitting burial. Your mother? Mm hmm. But I thought uh, your mother died many years ago. <laughs> I want to give your late mother a befitting burial. Okay, you will not understand. You will not understand. Yes, you know, when my mother died, I had nothing. I was broke at that time. I I just did the little I could do. It hurt me so much that I couldn't give my mother a befitting burial. But what could I do? But you know what? I vow that someday, you know, I will give my mother a befitting burial. Thank God today I have the money I can do that. So I want to immortalize her name. Wow. Yes, my That's mother. It. My mother suffered so much to raise me. That's a nice one. Hmm? <laughs> uh, that. uh, whatever you want, tell me. I will be there for you. Although we have raised so many people. Eh? I can count one or two or three or four or five of the, the your, your guys that you've raised. Let me tell you something. I will go to them. I will go and tell guys. men. Now a man to remember memorial funeral of late mother eh? <laughs> we will give you support you have raised men now don't worry yourself we will give you support thank you so when you say to i got my chain if you three boy there thank you i know what you can do doctor. thank you so much thank You're you welcome. so much but first thing i'll do is to finish my house okay yes so they are roofing it right now once we're done then next will be the burial hey i trust you I know the kind of edifice you you were erect in that village. <laughs> I trust you. <laughs> As a we're selling ah. one. Okay. Okay. <laughs> you keep calling me this name. Is anybody begging me to be king? You deserve to be begged. Huh? You deserve to be begged. Oh. Okay, put a gun on me. Put a gun on me. What's a survivor? What's a You deserve to be begged okay. because it's a we're selling. Thank you. Thank you. Thank I'll leave now. It's been a beautiful day. Eh? I can do it. Alright. There's no money in this card. What? There's no money in this card. How? Please check it again. There's no money on it, ma'am. Thank you.
Yes, hello? Uh, you don't sound okay. What's wrong? I'm not okay. I went to pick up a few things from the supermarket on my way back from court. Only to realize that there was no money in the ATM card you gave to me. What kind of embarrassment is this? Ah, well, you should have been checking the balance there. You've had the card for about a month now. Really? Who well, you asked me to spend as I wish? Uh, Why well, you are spending as you wish? You'll be checking balance. The money can finish now. So that's what you're saying? When well, you were receiving the alerts in the ATM card, you would at least told me that the money had finished. Instead of getting embarrassed this way. It's okay. Let's let's not argue. Let's not argue. How much do you need to clear the stuff here? Anyway, don't worry, don't worry. Just hang on. Hang on. Just hold on. Eh? Hold on. Just hold on, hold on, you don't have to. Alright, cool. I just sent you 500k now, so you can sort out whatever you want to buy. Later, we'll fix the ATM issue, okay? Is that okay? Maybe. Which one is maybe? Cheer up now, please. Okay, thank you. I'll come and see you later at the office. Alright, take care. Later, I'll sort it out, okay? So sorry about that. I've tried now. What is it? Are you going out? What does it look like? Okay. I told you that I'm going out with your jeep today. To where? Umu Abalawai meeting, of course. Remember. So because of Umu Abalawai meeting or Abalawai meeting, I should not go to the site to inspect my project. Didn't I tell you about that uh, land at Amachara? Didn't I tell you? Oh, you did, sweetheart. It's a big piece of land. They are already fencing right now. I need to be there physically. It's not a small project. 20 acres of land. I understand, but then, excuse me, sweetheart. Now what are we going to do about it? Do what? I mean, your jeep. I mean, the jeep, of course. What about your own car? What? Wait a minute, sweetheart. You want me? to go with that old car? An old car that doesn't have AC to change my color. Come on, this meeting we are talking about is where you will see all this ugly, fat belly women local champions, I mean, hiring G-Wagon just for my brother wine meeting. And you want me, the future, Lord of the skin. Take a look at your wife and I'm sorry. Oh, pull out that one. Baby, and you want me to go with that old car? Banodronoma. Come Mama, on. You have many options. Don't insist on my own car. Baby, maybe you do not understand. I'm trying to protect your image here. And what an image to protect? And you don't have an image. You and I know that. So just go to that meeting if you want to. Let you do not have an image. I do have an image no, no. as the future Lolo of this community. Come on. You have not prepared to attend that meeting. I am, sweetheart. Agum. My Agum. You're actually leaving me. What a stingy man. Let me care. I must. Now. What is it? Where's the money now? You're just leaving. Which money? I'm going to fill my car now. I'm going out with my friends. To where? Question, question. Hmm? I'm going to the local amusement park in Nagulu. There's nowhere else to chill in this village. Pop C, you not try. You not try. You just brought us from Lagos to this, to this miserable village just because you want to be king. 
Stop talking like a foolish girl. I'm not foolish, you. I'm not foolish. I'm a wise girl. I'm not a foolish girl. How can you call your father's home a miserable village? Huh? Don't you know as a future princess of this community you know how to talk? Daddy, when are you going to become the king? We don't tire. I don't tire. Daddy, try now. Try and be the king so that eh, I can show these small, small village girls what it takes to be a princess. Daddy, you know your daughter. You are dressing like a street girl. <laughs> Daddy, there's nothing wrong with my dressing. I'm at home. I can wear anything I, I feel comfortable in. Say so. Huh? Go and remove that thing before it edge off your skin. Daddy, I know this style. This is scope. Eh? You want me to forget about this money? Daddy, bring that money. Uh -huh. Bring everything, bring everything. Hey! 5,000 naira. What am I going to do with 5,000 now? Am I going to enter bike or kata? Yes. Your princess? Yes, bike is 1,200 chata. Hey! What kind of a stingy factor is this? Stingy factor. Chifa to carry a chief for one year. Take it easy. Don't be a king, this not a To be a king, this not a if I could carry a guy, man, take it easy, you know. To be a king is not a daughter. I think they say charity begins at home. If I could carry a start from your home. Money not be everything in this world. You get money, we know. You get connection, we don't see ya. You get money, we know. You get connection, we don't see ya. To be a king is not a do or die affair. Chifa kukaria, chifu anio, take it easy. Chifa kukaria, guy man, take it easy, you know. Uh, where is the engineer? One thousand. One thousand to where? One thousand. Allo, of what? Bamba. What about the foreman? Two thousand. Ha. Two thousand. Allo. You can't progress like that. There are three trailers coming with about one million blocks. Don't tell me if they, they went out. You have to hire enough hands. Eh? The fencing must start immediately. This is just a security man's house. So we shouldn't work time on this. Start the fencing immediately. Let me know here, sorry, that I come back. And uh, nobody is here. Yeah. Okay. But you see them. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. Don't 
Why are you hurrying up? What's going on? Kelm, take it easy. I'm kind of messy. You are, you are hurrying up. Uh, what is happening? I hope all is well. Okay, for all is well. But all is not well. Ah. Oh, did anybody die? Nobody died. But something bad, very bad, is about happening in our community. And what could that be? Somebody came to my house this morning and told me that Chief Akukalia is building structures and facing the whole length and breadth of our amateur community land. Meaning what? That is why I'm here, Okafo. I went there myself. And it is indeed true that Akukalia is trying to occupy the land. Did you see him? They, 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 they said he had come and gone. So I engaged the supervisor. And he confirmed that the land belongs to Akukalia. He even said that Akukalia has all the white government papers to back it up. Can you imagine? This is serious. Are you sure of what you are telling me? Ah, what do we do now? Something is bad. Let us go and inform Ono and the other elders. No, no, no. Wait. Let us go to Akukalia's house and confirm first. Something else might be happening there. Okay, are you what are you confirming? And what else could be happening? No one can tell you. You can't tell. Huh? Okay, okay. If you see. Uh, wait, if you insist. Uh, wait, let me just quickly, quickly. Akukalia, you cannot sell that land. It is a community land from time immemorial. It is not your personal land. We granted your request to build a factory on one plot and then you want to take over the whole land. Please call off this transaction immediately and save yourself some embarrassment before it creates further problems. What nonsense are you talking about? Huh? So because you and I are from the same kindred, you think you can talk to me anyhow? Now where is the community sea of all? Where is the survey plan? That's my own CFO. That's my own survey plan. Where's your own? Okay, this is not a matter of brandishing papers whose authenticity cannot be ascertained. Chenduka, take your eyes off that land, otherwise it will blind you. By the way, have you forgotten our soon be the equal of this community? And what that bestows on me is the custodian of all the land in this community. It's your girlfriend. I'm very disappointed in you. You had the effrontery to escort this man to my house to harass me? No, Chief Akukara. It is not harassment. It is true that Amacha is our community land. But not... Now listen. If you think you have power, go there and stop the work on the fencing work that's going on. And you see me in my true colors. Get out of my house! Gossiping elders. Ungrateful elders. Go and stop work there. Let me see. Take it easy. To be a king is not a daughter. Chifakukalia. Gaima. Take it easy. To be a king is not a daughter. Chifakukalia. Chifuania. Sometimes I wonder where people keep their conscience because of little bribery. You decided to sell your conscience, yo. but mind you, this throne is not for sale. If I put no show, give me the in a man and get the chief of Kukaria. We are the holy one. He's up. He's up. Are you heading to Akukalia's house? Yes, yes. Uh, any problem? We are just from there. And you won't believe that that man 
is hell-bent on taking over our community land at Amachara. He is facing the whole land as we speak. We need to stop him. Yes. Um, Ichi, I do not think that that is the best way to go about this matter. What is the best way? Come with few years, one area. I want believe you Instead of a man's game to escape him, he will cut off the tail and hold on to something. Why are you talking like this? How am I talking? Let me ask you a question, Ichi Endoka. If you challenge Akokalia, will you win? If we challenge Akokalia, will we win? Akokalia is rich. He is connected. Oh my mother. Instead of fighting a battle, we know we will lose. I suggest that we, the Ichiyas, come together. Meet Akokalia and find a common ground and see what we can get out of this. Ichi is up. Huh? Is this what we are going there to tell him? What kind of question is this? So I must now tell you my mission to my king's man's house. Eh? Are you, ha, have you told me your mission to where you are going? Achalayago. Achalayago. Coward. Traitor. Evula, evula, lumma, tulobo. Always sabotaging noble efforts. Eh? Come along, Okafu. We must put an end to this matter. Akukalia yes. cannot annex over 20 hectares of land all to himself. Mbang. For what? I can't play no Buddha. It's not done. I try to be a general, but I try not to be a How can? All I'm saying is that you need to uh, sort out the elders so that when the matter gets to litigation, we will uh, bear witness that it is your land. But I have done enough for this community to deserve that land. Uh, I'm not saying that you should uh, pay for the land, eh? but you need to uh, sort out some people. I uh, one uh, chief, so that they will not raise any objections. But not everybody should be sorted out. People like Kendoka and his school conspirators eh? should be ignored. Oh, totally. Do you know that I saw them on my way here and they were trying to convince me not to come and see you? They can go to hell. They're already in hell. Just supervise that they are in the hottest part of it. How do you open to get Huh? So how much will be required to sort them out? Uh, let's say 100,000 Naira each. And we are eight elders. 100,000? Yeah. Then how much is the entire land? Oh, Akwaguno Kuzgo. 20 acres of land. Hey! It does not even scratch the surface. Our land is very expensive now. Yeah. Uh, okay, I will give them 20,000 naira each. Hi, Ako. Ako, okay, but it's in the chair. How can you be giving them 20,000 naira? It's insulting. Uh, remember, you are not yet king. And this people can make things very difficult for you. But I deserve to have that land. I'm qualified. Uh, yes. Huh? Uh. Um, because of the advice in Anya, I'll give them 50,000 naira each. Who doesn't like? Let him go to court. Fifty. I will try and come. If we see now, you are my If you even to let alone, I say that we may agree. Oh, this is not easy. Oh, no, no, no. If we are not to let alone, we may agree. This is not easy. Is this how he is going to rule us by confiscating all our land? That's exactly why we are here. As we speak, he is already facing the whole place. And from what he said, he has already gone to the government to get papers that he is the rightful owner of the land. Hi, are you serious? Yes. Ah, what do we do? I don't know. I am calling for an emergency meeting of Indichia tomorrow. Uh -huh. That's a good one. At 4 p.m. in my house. Good. That's when we decide on how to tackle Akokalia. Good. On oh, no, yeah. the man has beaten more than he can chew. Ah, ah, I like that. I'll be there. I'll be there. I'll be there. Okay. Thank you.
I just saw um, Ndoka and Ndoka for leaving this place. Oh, what did they come here to do? Um, honestly, it's about Alcogalia. That he has confiscated all our land. As I'm talking to you, he's constructing a fence around all our land. What kind of man is that? Eh? This is the kind of man he is. This is from Chief Akokalia to you. Ignore whatever Mundoka and Okafo have told you. Mundoka has an old grudge against Chief Akokalia. That is why he's busy spreading all these lies and misinformation. Ignore them. That land they are telling you about, Akokalia wants to build a big factory in it. A factory that will benefit our people. They will be building motorcycles, uh, spare parts, laptops, phones, all these new new things. Is that what he said? Of course. Are you sure? Yes. Hey. Look, let me tell you. Akokalia has done so much for this community. I intend to do more. It's good. Eh? But you should have told us that earlier. Akokalia should have told us instead of going there to uh, cause confusion. That is what he was planning to do before Ndoka and Ndoka for started spreading lies and misinformation. I told you he, Ndoka has a grudge against uh, Akokalia. Look, do you know what a factory of that magnitude will do for the people of this community? A factory that white people will come and, and, and be, and, and be uh, doing business with us. Eh? Even your son, your son Ifani, that graduated since uh, and is in Lagos looking for work. Ifani will come here and get uh, work in the office with so many other youths of this land. up and down looking for a job for him. Uh, uh, Ifani you know, will just enter yeah. and start work immediately. Eh? Take this money. Ignore whatever they are telling you. More will come. Hmm? I, I even have to go and meet all the other reasonable elders and give them what Akukale said I should give them. Take, this is your own. This is your own, and more is still going to come. This is small. Ignore them. Whatever they tell you is a lie. Ignore them. Take it easy. Take it easy. So, Akokalia has graduated from taking people's wife to taking our collective land. <laughs> and he wants to be Igwe. Huh? We have to give this matter a second thought. I know he has money, but money is not everything. That is exactly why we're here. Let us meet in my house by 4 o'clock tomorrow and take a firm decision on this. Hmm. <sighs> what about Unu? Let us leave him out for now. Okay? Yes. yes. It's better we each is take a collective position before we involve him. Daluno. He's all he's all. Monago. Ebweji a jogu. Eh monago. Eh oh. Che so. Ogusia tu sikenany. What we go na mune kene? Haven't we greeted before? Um monago. I want to see you inside. Uh, yeah. But we're having an important discussion here. One ago. Eh? I said I want to see you inside. Eh? See my discussion. Ndichi. Oh, oh, I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Oh? Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Is it not money that traitor is over is holding? Exactly. Akokalia has given him money to bribe the elders. Huh. And the Zog agreed to be the errand boy. You know how cheap and treacherous Izog is. No integrity, no honor at all. Do you think our colleagues will fall for the money? Uh, one cannot say. Let us wait till we meet tomorrow. Meanwhile, we still need to see Ichiwaguchi and Kalo. 
Uh, yes, that is true. Take it easy. To be a king is not a daughter. Chifa kukalea. Guy man. Take it easy. To be a king is not a daughter. Chifa kukalea. Chifa wanya. Take it easy. To be a king is not a daughter. Chifa kukalea. Guy man. Take it easy. Um, Monago. I am a man who accepts defeat when he is defeated. Chief Akokalia has registered that land with the government and they have given him documents. Nobody can do anything about it. Registered? How? Our community land? See, it is not a matter of talking, our community land. The government does not deal with word of mouth. The government deals with evidence. And Akokalia has the documents. That is evidence. What of if we all go there and stop him from taking possession of the land? He will use the army, police, and even civil defense, plus no safety, to arrest everybody and dump you in prison. Do you want to go to jail? See, the best thing to do is not to challenge Akokalia. But rather to meet with him and then find the common ground and see what we can get from this. Mm. This is for you. Take it. What about other elders? Have they taken this money? Not everybody. I have not had time to go to everybody. But I know they will take it. You see, even uh, this Ndoka and, uh, and Okafo that are moving around causing confusion. If I give it to them, they will take it. But mm, I will not give it to them. Whatever they will do, let them do it. Jesus, hmm? I am not comfortable with this. Monago, it is not a matter of being comfortable. It is a matter of common sense. Remember, Chief Akokalia will soon be a Iwe. And it is better to be in his good books than to be in his bad books. Oh. Chief Akokalia Take it easy To be a king is not a daughter Chief Akokalia Chief Akokalia Take it easy Welcome. Hasn't anybody come? Nobody. Ah, and the time is fast spent. Oh no, don't worry. You know our people and their attitude to time. Please, they will still come. Okay, for this is not a matter of attitude to time. Can you imagine that Ibe Kanjo of all people is not picking my call? Something is strong, so look out. No. And this is not good for our community. That is an understatement. Akukalia is fast corrupting our community. Before him, there was nothing like bribery and turning the truth upside down. But since he came back from the city, strange things have been happening. Our people can no longer say one thing and stand by it. And the Zog is always there to support an Ojimon. Birds of a feather. Zog has always been a lazy man. A lazy and a corrupt man. It is only his dead father's good image that qualified him as an idiot. Yes. Otherwise, he is rotten. No honor, no integrity. Ah. It's sad. It's very, very sad. Look up, please. Come and sit down. At least let's let me make a love for you. Chifa kukalia, chifu wanyo, take it easy, to be a king is not a daughter. Chifa kukalia, gaimano. 
We are here for the meeting you called. I hope we are not late. Won't you offer me a seat? You can sit down anywhere. Oh, thank you. Hello. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Won't you offer our school an us? Chifako Kalia, I did not invite you to any meeting. Am I not one of the elders of this community anymore? Didn't you call it for a meeting of the elders? No. I called for a meeting of Indi Chia, and you are not one. Besides, the meeting is about you and the confusion you are bringing into our community. How dare you talk to me like that? How dare you? Because you begged me for money and I said no. Huh? You're not constituting yourself into opposition. I did not beg you for any money. If you say that again, I will break your head. Don't you interject when I'm talking. Look at you. Look, I'm a Lagos guy. I'm not like a local champion like you. You don't like me. I don't like you. So stay off my track. I only invited following the chair to deliberate over an issue. What offense have I committed? So, where are those you invited? Where are they? They did not respond to you because they know you of no use. A flavor for Gable. Let me warn you for the last time. Don't you cross my path. If you do, Chile could die to go one. These men here are not gentlemen. Idiot. Guys, let's go. A good man. I can tell you that evil and lies can run fast. But I assure you that good and truth will surely overcome and overtake. It's just a question of time. Please, forget whatever you have with that evil man before he harms you. I have only one husband and I am too young to be a widow. Biko, no, Biko. Eh? Mokoma. Forget about that man, please. Thank you, my queen. Thank you for your tender love and care. Thank you. I have heard all you said, and I will do exactly as you say. Mm -hmm. Hey, Nan, I just finished preparing your food. Please come inside and eat. Oh? Huh? Let me help you up. Let's go. Let's go here. So I was caught today. <sighs> Hectic as usual. Mm. All these half baked male lawyers trying to intimidate we ladies. But you know they can't intimidate me because. I'm equal to the tax. Anyhow they want it. <laughs> I trust you. If they give you fire, you give them more fire. <laughs> ah, so, um, you said you wanted to tell me something. Yes. Um, <clears throat> same dream I've been having. I had it again. My mother came to me and told me specifically to 
go to the village and help my people. I don't believe in all those dreams and superstitions. Village people are evil and they must be avoided at all costs. To some extent, I agree with you. But not all village people. Yes. And we can't all run away from the village because of the misbehavior of some people. Come on, no. Only well, there you go again. Argue with a lawyer. Can't you just humble yourself for once and listen to me? But this is not a legal matter. It's general knowledge. Everybody knows that. Not everybody is bad. <laughs> Fine. It's, it's all right. You can go ahead and do whatever you want to do. But if anything comes out of this village adventure, count me out. Hey. I can't just count you out like that now, my darling. I was hoping you would go with me to the village. So when we're done with what we're doing, we'll go inspect uh, uh, the house that I'm building. A house? Yes. Um, Wait, you're building a house in the village? Yes, I'm building a house. After that first dream, I, I realized I needed to have a base. I mean, a big guy like me, I have houses all over Nigeria. It's somehow for people to say that I don't even have a house in my own village. It's, it's wrong. You're building a house in the village and you didn't even bother to tell your fiancé. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's just that, I mean, anytime we talk about village stuff, it gets you upset. So I didn't want to add to your problems with the whole village thing. I'm sorry. It's fine. It's okay. You can do whatever you want to do. You can go to the village. I don't care. I'm staying here in Lagos because I was born and brought up here. It's fine by me. I can go. No, it's not. It's not. It's not. Let me hear It's not that bad. I plan to get to my village this weekend. Really? Yes, and I'll be needing company. Will you be free? Well, um, Otogwa will be free for you. Anytime, any day. Eh? Thank you. I trust you. <laughs> Thank you. I've already sent an advance party to the village to put things in order. Okay, okay. That's nice. Especially security. Yes, so. And it's, it's crazy. A man has to secure himself. Yeah. So the reports I'm getting from there are quite impressive. You know, I've not been to the village in a long while. Very long. So kind of skeptical about this trip. I don't know how it will turn out. Well, let's just get there and see how things turn out. Huh? Whichever way, I know we will always conquer. You know, they treated my mother and I very badly back then. Very badly. I, even though I know there are still good men there. It's well, you already told me the story. But one thing you should know is that in everything, there is a good side. Without a push, maybe you wouldn't have gotten to the place you are today. Think about it from that angle. Eh? They pushed you, Hatcho Bag, okay, they put it in the wound. That's it. It's well, we'll get there. Imani Fugodabu, Igama Gwadabu, Honya Managame, Ossia Nelanya Neda, Nemeka Wamaduka, Makama. I'm a Katikana, I can't want a more of a dog, no one a mile can go up a dog, no one here. Who moves in kingdom? Who moves in kingdom? Who moves in kingdom? I'm a Katikana, I'm a dog, no one a mile can go up a dog, no one a mile can go up a dog, no one a mile can go Kingdom, 
not in a good shape though. It was actually built by a matron. If she's still alive, she'll be very old by then. I hope she's still alive. Let's drive in and take a look. <laughs> Um, <coughs> just take this file to us. Um, welcome, young man. What can I do for you? My name is Nemeka Maduka, son of Chikeze and Ezin Nemaduka. And this is my friend Duncan. I was born in this hospital 35 years ago. Really? Yes. My mother told me that you are the matron who delivered me. <laughs> it has been a long time, my son. And I have dealt with so many people that I can hardly remember. I know, I know. Actually, I don't, uh, I don't live here in the village. I've been away for a very long time. For many years. I stay in Lagos. Yes, I was coming back and... You know, on my way back, I, I saw your hospital, brought back memories, so I decided to you know, stop by. I must commend you, madam. I mean, all these years, you're still running this place, you know, although you know, a lot of things have happened, but you're trying. You're still delivering health services to our people. My dear, thank you so much. It is God. We just do our best and leave the rest to God. Yeah. And. My mother told me that the day we were discharged, she didn't have money to pay the bills. The nurse insisted that we will not leave until she pays. She couldn't do anything about it because there was no money. You came, you heard what was happening, you wrote off the bill and asked us to leave. I can't even remember because I've done so for so many of our people. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. You have really done your best. But it can be better. You know, uh, my friend and I, when we walked in, before we came into your, your office, we decided to take a look around. We noticed that the hospital has gone through a lot. A couple of things are no longer in place as they used to. So I made uh, some arrangements for something to get to you. This is a check of 10 million now. Just put your hand there. Cash the money, use it to upgrade some facilities in the hospital. 10 million? For me? Yes, you deserve it, madam. Just put your name and you can cash the check. And I will be supporting him with 1 million now. Nah. Yes. <laughs> hey! Just um, give me your account number before we leave. I will fix that. Good. What is happening? 
Is this real or am I dreaming? <laughs> hey, God! Oh my God. Oh my God. Hey! Me. All this for me. <laughs> I know, oh my God, that my ready money. I know it's not far from me. Oh my God. I know when he is. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Imani for God, he got my word of who you have another game, or see the land you need. Then make a one manuka, one come one, and make a okay one amor, but don't know what I mean like I go up or don't know what you are. kingdom, Jenuka, I greet you. I, I greet you too. Uh, Onye Kanke Nebiko. It's me, Nemeka, son of Maduka. Ah, Nemeka kwa? Son of Maduka. Which Maduka? Maduka Okeke. Eh? Hey! Eh? Nemeka? Is this you? Nemeka Nemeka Nyao! Nemeka Nyao! Hey! <laughs> no, I, I cannot believe this. I cannot believe this. Hey, you're, you're welcome, my son. Eh? Uh, meet my friend Duncan. Yeah. Uh. You're welcome too. Uh, no, no. Uh, no, no. Okay. Where are you going to? Uh, we are going to know who's house for a meeting. Our Igwe died since three years. And we are yet to have a replacement. Uh, that is what we are going to deliberate on. I see. That's quite serious. I believe God will help us make a good choice. Amen. Mm. Hey, Nameka. Um, where are you coming from now? Where are you coming from? And where are you going to? Nameka, who owns all these motors? All these motors, who own them? <laughs> it's uh, too many questions. Too many questions. Don't worry, I'll answer all of them in the evening. Hmm? I'll come see you in your place, 5 p.m. Hmm? 5 p.m. I'll come to you. Okay, now. I, I'm, I, I, I'll be expecting you. Eh? You know they talk hey, no, no. None. Welcome. Okafu. You better have me. 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 You better have Hey! Even a man. 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 a a young man that was chased out by his uncle no, under some unpleasant circumstances. Hey! It's not somebody everybody will want to celebrate. Look at the affluence! Hey! That's why our people say that nobody can predict tomorrow. Good. Oh, my There is nothing the Lord cannot do. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. I should not have one. You have spoken the truth, Wosu. Wosu, you have spoken the truth. Hey! You have spoken the truth. 
God has blessed me. Yes. Over the years. My, my, my years of toiling, my years of hard work. God crowned those years with blessings. Amen. Too <laughs> much blessings, though. I cannot lie. <clears throat> the cars you saw with me, they're all my cars. <laughs> A few of them actually I have more. <laughs> I have chains of businesses with branches in Lagos. Abuja and Portacot. More branches coming soon. I also do business abroad. When you saw me, I was coming from my house in Lagos, heading to my house in the village here. Your house? Yes. I built a house in Nuneze Kindred. Hold on, please. Are you the owner of the big house everybody's talking about? The only of such house in Nuneze? Yes. Hey! By the grace of God, it's uh -huh. it's my house. Hey, <laughs> you don't know. Uh -huh. Yes, it's my house. To the glory of God, it's oh. it's mine. You know, Ibekwe chased out my mother and I and took over my father's property. I had no choice. By the time God blessed me, I didn't want trouble. I just went to the next village and bought land there and built my house. <laughs> hey, who would have believed that the poor Richard in the make of yesterday would have turned out like this? Eh? It's God. Hey. God is just wonderful. The news is everywhere. Mm. What you gave to the metro 
and the community school. Even the microfinance bank of the community. Yeah, it's, it's, it's my style. Yes, I believe in giving. I believe in lifting others. Yes, I believe in helping others. You know, it's quite difficult right now doing business at that low level and still, you know, keep on thriving. Not easy at all. So, if you can get a little push, why not? God will continue to bless you. Amen. God will continue to bless you. Amen. And God will continue to bless you. Amen. <laughs> Amen. And bless you too, sir. Bless you too. You see... I've not forgotten what you did for me and my mother. How you stood by us in our trying time. You know, most difficult time of our lives. You were there for us. Thank you, sir. My dear, it has always been my policy. To stand for the truth, no matter what happens. Keep it up, sir. Keep it up. Thank you. Hey, Sir, Chenduka, a little token of appreciation from me. 500,000. Hey, hey! 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 I'm going to check. I should keep it all. Hey! Mban, if you had a new day, boy. If you had a new day, boy. Chichi! Chichi! Malabu! Pala di aba la abu abu nyabu na ye kubo ya na new day, boy. Hey! Hey, what you move, boy? You can't have one to you. Can you come to me? Thank you, Nameko. All this for us. All this for us. Chai. All this for us. Wait. 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 Yes, you woke up, Marama. You who does it? Ah, it reminds me of my days as a youth. Hey, yes? money for us. Hey. Hey. Oh my God! If I can hack on him, may you live long. Amen. May you live long. Amen. Hmm? It's so wonderful. I will grab. I will grab the one. Hey. Hey. No, hey. no, no. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, hey. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, I'll I'll go straight to the point. Yes. Yes. I called for this meeting for three reasons. First, I want to reintroduce myself because I've been away for a while been away from this village and mm. I left this village under unpleasant circumstances. I believe most of you know this story. But God chose to wipe my tears away. Mm. God has blessed me. Mm. And for that reason, I bear no grudges. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yes, I I have chosen to forgive and forget. Um <clears throat> Secondly, I want to thank you all for the way you've been running the affairs of this village, of our community. Our king has been gone for about three years now, without any replacement. But you all here have made sure that everything has been going smoothly. Uh, issues are handled amicably, justly, most importantly. And for that reason, you have my utmost respect. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you. <coughs> Thank you. And third reason, and of course, the last, maybe. <laughs> I intend to give my mother a befitting burial. Befitting burial. My mother died many years ago when I had nothing. And my mother, my mother suffered to raise me. And even while dying, she kept on suffering. 
At that time, I had nothing. But I made a vow that I was going to give my mother a befitting burial. I did the much I could do at that time. Then I started hustling. And maybe because of my vow, God decided to bless me. Today, I want to give her the kind of burial that a man like me will give to his mother. Because, sitting with you now, by the special grace of God, I am one of the richest young men in this country. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yes. Say it again! Yeah. Say it again! Yeah. That is what it is. I can decide to bury my mother in the southeast. Very high in southwest. Oh, yes. Very high in northeast. So um it will be a grand event. A lot of dignitaries will be coming from far and wide and even outside the country to be a memorable event. So I seek your cooperation and guidance for me to achieve um, my dream. Okay. Thank you very much. You're welcome. And God bless you. Uh, mm. no. Thank you. Thank you, our son. And uh, welcome once again. Uh, it has always been our prayers that uh, good things come into our community. And this is one of the best things to happen to our community in a long while. You're welcome. Um, we are so amazed, in fact, astonished. Yes by what you've done for our community hospital, our community school, that school that is totally dilapidated. We have spoken to government over and over and uh, nobody, nobody listens to us. And uh, you just come now and um, have upgraded it overnight. Thank you very much. Not to forget what you've done to our community bank. It has become like um, one of the big banks, but it's a huge deposit we did there. We cannot continue to count. Um, there is so much you have done. Uh, we are indeed proud of you. You are a worthy son of, uh, of Umudim. You are welcome. Uh, as for your mother's burial, ha, trust us to give you the best of our cooperation. Anything you need from us, the Ichis, and the entire community, please do not hesitate to ask. I will give you even extra. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. well, on that day, we will show you that uh, indeed you are most welcome back to your community. Umudim. <laughs> So please drink go. Drink, drink, drink. <laughs> uh, hello, sir. It's wrong. Where are you? Uh, I'm in a meeting. Is it a meeting called by that small boy? Uh, yes, yes. In fact, I, I, I'm wondering why you know, we even called Austin DJ to attend a meeting with this small boy. This nobody. Very shameful. What is he talking about? Nothing, no. Eh? He's just boasting uh, what he has done and what he intends to do here and there. <laughs> what, what is he saying? What has he done for the community? Eh? Anyway, I want us to see you gently. There's a few, uh, few things to sort out. Uh... Let me uh, hang around for some while and then see what he's up to. Okay, okay. Come over immediately. You finish. Uh, I will, sir. Thank you, sir. All right. Thank you. Balenza.
500,000 naira each. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then, uh, Uno who has a little more. Please don't be jealous. Uh, he's Uno. You know. <laughs> Please spend as you like. <laughs> a gift from me to you. Mm -hmm. Spend as you like. Sources that some of you here intend to take new younger wives. I said, You see, you see, you know, I, I found out that once a man starts getting old, he begins to look for younger women to help the system. <laughs> yeah, so um, if you have such plans, huh, I will support you. <laughs> I'm disappointed in you so-called elders. Why are you so gullible? A Yahoo boy calls you to a meeting to give you money. Instead of asking the source of his money, you start jumping up and down, praising him. You fellow Nemem. Exactly, Ako. That is why I did not touch the money. Yes. Did you ask for the surface with money to be able to spray such money? Did you? They say that uh, it's an uh, importer and exporter, and it has many, many hotels. Importer and exporter of what? Silver or gold? Huh? Look at it. What is using to confuse you people? A son of a nobody calling you to a meeting and you're attending and you call yourself elders. Uh, Ako, the meeting actually took place in Onowu's house. What's, yes. the, what's the difference? What's the difference? The boy called for a meeting. Onowu hosted it. Onowu at that level. Poor. Chai. Blood money. A small boy whose money has no foundation. Because I go to Kandi the Kamu when the foundation real money. Did you ever ask? And you, instead of concentrating on if they are stake, which is making me an new way, you benefit greatly and graciously from it. I'm disappointed. Um, Our Igwe in waiting. We are sorry for that. And such a thing will never happen again in this our community. Umudim. You already Igwe. Please. Please. It's already ten o'clock. Go home, Pico. 
Go home. Th thank you. Be well. Yeah. Uh, good night, sir. <clears throat> now you see them walk around. You think human beings are walking around. You don't know it's a lieba, a lieba. Dogs. Oh, uh, <laughs> you're a good son of this land. Chief Chief. <laughs> in, in, in Chief, Chief. I must I, I must tell you. I like to see younger men yeah. do the things you're doing. Uh, we must tell ourselves the truth. When you have achieved in the city, you must come and show your people that you have achieved. Okay. And uh, you have done that very well. Thank you, sir. Thank, Thank, you. Thank, you. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Chief Chief. <laughs> Chief Chief. Oh, this is a good. Chief. This is also for you. <laughs> Um, oh see, yeah. Yes, yeah. yes. Anya yeah. Majoro <laughs> on this one. Sir. Yes. <laughs> uh, cola mm. for you, sir. Um, Pico. <clears throat> I want to use that one over there and this one mm. as cola mm. to invite you to my mother's final burial rites. Mm. The invitation card will be out soon and I'll send it over. Mm. Yes, Chief, you're a good man. Yes, a prominent son you know, of our place and a foremost philanthropist. And he's waiting, waiting. Oh, <laughs> forgive me, sir. <laughs> <laughs> I heard. No, I heard. <laughs> Igwe. <laughs> Congratulations, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> you're welcome. Thank you, sir. I have heard so much about you. And, uh,. I have been expecting this visit. I didn't even know it would come this soon. <laughs> Thank you, sir. I made my name and money in Lagos and then decided to come back to the village to help the community. And I'm very excited and happy that you are following my footsteps. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> You're welcome. Thank you, sir. Well, as they say, curiosity kills the cat. I want to know what kind of business you're into so that we can see what we can do business together. <laughs> <laughs> that would be nice, sir. That would be very nice. Thank you very much, sir. Mm. <clears throat> I'm into the hospitality business. Yes, I own Tigana Group of Companies, uh, Tigana Hotels, Tigana Clubs. Uh, we have branches in Abuja, Lagos, and Portacot. Other branches coming to you. I'm also into real estate. I buy houses, I buy estates, I buy lands, I develop and I sell. Yes, I'm also into exotic wines. Yes, I produce wines as well. Good, good ones. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and so many other things. So many other things. And you achieved this all in your young age? It's God. This God must be wonderful. <laughs> it's just God, though. It's just God. You know, anytime I come back home, I try to encourage our people. You know what they say: we rise by lifting others. Yeah. Yes. Just as you have been doing, it will not be good, you know, for it to be just me and you doing well in the community. We need to raise more people. Uh, you know, the more uh, people who can do the things we do, the better for our community. <laughs> Very well. I'm very well thought out. I will attend the funeral. Ah, thank you, sir. And uh, I'll come with my fellow Igwe's. Just make sure you prepare well for us. I'm equal to the task. I know. <laughs> <laughs> From this, I know. <laughs> yes, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. I'll be ready for you. Okay. Thank you so mm. much mm. for the warm welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Mm. Because I permit us, we have to be on our way. Yes, yes. I'll be leaving for Lagos tomorrow morning. 
um, I wish you a safe trip when you are uh, going. Uh, make sure you keep in touch. I will. But can I alone? Like you said, we rise by lifting all that. Yes. Uh, very important. gonna have me hearing about my goodness you look so good thank you well my name is adora i'm the princess of this community i'm actually a lagos big babe too bad my father brought us down here because he wants to be king and it's been nearly two years and nothing has happened i really need to move on with my life sorry not to bore you with my talk how can i meet you later <laughs> okay i'll be leaving for lagos tomorrow morning but I'll definitely return for my mother's final burial rites. So maybe we'll see when I get back. Okay, that's fine. Okay, can I have your number so I can chat to you privately? Thank you. Thank you so much. So I'm going to chat to you. Jesus, bye. Adora! Get inside. If your father catches you here, he will skin you alive. Oh! <laughs> mm. Strong man. Hmm. You know, you didn't do well. Those things you brought, you just brought them for my husband. My husband is blessed with stinginess. Believe me, he would not give me a dime from those things you brought. So. <laughs> Oh, do not be embarrassed. Ah, oh, you are indeed a strong man. I go. Hurry up, huh? There you go. Woo! Thank you. I will manage this. I will. Thank you very much. Run along. These are the particulars of the car you claim to have bought for me. Of course, I can see. Whose names are those particulars? <laughs> My name. Your name. And you claim to have bought the car for me. Later on, your friends will start boasting that you bought the latest Benz for your fiancé. Not knowing you bought the car for yourself and just allow me to use it. I don't believe this. Is this how to welcome me back from the village? How am I supposed to welcome you? Did we not speak on phone? You just bought this car for me shortly before you left the village. And I did not have enough time to go through it. I'm just so disappointed. Why are you being disappointed? You did not buy this car for me. I'm a lawyer and I know the implications of this. You can legally take the car away from me when we have issues in the future. What is wrong with you? Are we planning to have issues? Huh? Are you planning to have issues with me? The car is yours. It doesn't matter. You can decide to do change of ownership. It's your car. And why would I go through the stress of change of ownership when you would have just bought the car in my name? Chris, I don't believe we're going through this. Listen to me, my love. This is not an issue. 
All right? It's your car. This is not going to be the only car I'll buy for you. I'll still buy bigger cars for you. It doesn't matter if it's in my name or yours. It's your car. Okay, fine. I'll explain. I, I, I got many cars, all right? Some buses were supposed to come in and then your car as well. I think the problem is from the dealer. He mixed it up. He put your own name in the, the papers of the bus. I can send for the papers so you see and confirm. I don't believe I'm going through this. I don't believe I'm going through this. Baby, I understand. It's just that I'm scared. I'm afraid. This, this, this was exactly what happened to my mom. My wicked dad took everything away from her when they got divorced and left us stranded. I, I just don't want to go through, through what happened to me before again. I don't want to. I'm sorry. Baby, I'm sorry now. I said I'm sorry. Hmm? I didn't mean to make you sad now. Baby. It's alright. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's okay. It's alright. I'm sorry. But baby. I see no reason why I should attend this burial. We're not married yet. My darling, don't say that. You're my fiance. I need you. I mean, if there are legal things to handle, you'll take care of them and other things as well. I'm going to have a lot of billboards all over our village and beyond. The responsibility will be huge, so I need you. Well, is it not just a barrier? You're making it seem as if it's a wedding or a carnival or something oh, big. I dare. It's going to be more like a carnival for my mother. Big stuff. Okay. I'm going to attend. Because I know you're very sensitive when it comes to issues of your mom. But I will come as a visitor, nothing more. And I won't want to repeat of what happened in the past. And what was that? My ex. He used me as a poster girl to get favors from ministers. And he later ended up marrying a secondary school local girl. So men are just so wicked. I'm not like that. I'm not like that. It's okay, I'll, I'll come. Just to make you happy.
I will not approve of that kind of thing. It is irresponsible to throw money like that in public. Mm. It is against the laws of this land. I can get him arrested and prosecuted for financial crimes. Yes, I can do it. Exactly. Huh? Hey, Nanuwa. Huh? Is he the only person that has ever made money? Oh, yeah, whole money. There's nobody who makes his money legitimately who spends it like that. They said that is his friends that uh, spend the money, not him. Ah, Koko. What come from primary school? Call of an affair, Eh? Yes, tell children. Show me your friends and I'll tell you who you are. Uh -huh. I call them. Eh? What kind of thing is this? Take a look at all those people that came there, all those men. Small, small boys. Eh? Do they look like people who suffer like us to make money? And I cannot see you throwing money in the air and you want us to clap for them. It's all. Hmm? My problem is that he is influencing the youth negatively. Eh? When they see this kind of spraying, they become something else, desperate and want to belong. And that's what leads them to Yahoo Yahoo or Money Ritual. <laughs> influencing them very negatively. Eh? After who do you blame? No. Something has to be done urgently. In fact, I will do something urgently. If I call it, and a small boy like that, how can he be? How can he be influencing the youth negatively? And the uh, government uh, was watching. If I only you remember, you go now. Hey, don't say. Hey, Adora, you are smart. You mean you went to that burial just to pick money? A princess like you? Oh. Mommy, I forget about that princess matter. See money. In the next 10 years, can you and dad give me this kind of money? Hmm? 
Mama, beg, I beg. I want to cancel my money. I'm very happy. <laughs> Let me cancel my money. Mommy, who knows? I might become a billionaire over tights. Billionaire? <laughs> over people's money? <sighs> the money you and dad are boasting about, is it your money? You think I don't know? Dad sold the community land and properties. Mommy, please, oh. Hey! Just shut up your dirty mouth, you rebellious child. When someone speaks the truth, they become a rebellious child. But no problem. Mommy, if you want to can't, can't. If you want to go, go. But remember, if you don't can't, nothing for you. Eh? As I'm here, I'm, I feel like I'm on top of the world. Hey! Nothing for me. Money! Let me hold on. Shoot, shoot. Mommy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Boss my head. Mommy, see money. See money. My hand is paining me. I cannot cut the game, no. <laughs> you really look like your money. Chief Money. Take it easy. To be a king is not a daughter. Chief Akukali. Guy, man. Take it easy. To be a king is not a daughter. Chief Akukali. Chief Money. Take it easy. To be a king. Adora, what is this nonsense I hear about you picking money at the funeral yesterday? Me? Adora, pick money? That's not possible. You stop lying before I deal with you. But I didn't do anything of such. Who is this? <laughs> okay. Daddy, you're just an harmless phone. <laughs> what kind of stupid harmless phone is it? How could you reduce yourself to such level? A princess? Don't you know this could cost me the throne? Do you know the source of the money you picked? You don't know that's how all these devilish small boys use girls like you for rituals? I'm sorry, Daddy. I, I didn't mean to offend you. Now go and bring the money. All of it. Daddy, there's no money. You. I mean, I gave out all the money to some less privileged kids I, I saw at the ceremony. I didn't come back with any money. Right? Liar. If I don't get that money, else... Calm down, sweetheart. Calm down. She did not come back with any money. Believe me. In fact, that was what I was discussing with her before you called. Do you know one woman called me, telling me what our daughter did for her own child? Our daughter gave her child... 3,000 Naira at the funeral. Yes. Daddy, yes. I, I, I gave out all the money. Hey, Daddy, I saw some young boys, eh? Your village young boys. They were dancing around with some masquerade. They started entertaining me. I just enjoyed it. And I started giving them the money. It's good to give, Daddy. Very good to give. <laughs> Next time you try to disgrace me in public, I will first of all disgrace you from the house. Get out of the way from here. Like mother, like daughter. Take it easy. Um, Sino, my name is Alberto, and over here is my younger brother, Frank, and that's my friend, Ikenna. Ikenna, my name. We are your brothers from this town. We admire you a lot and the progress you've made in business. Your name is everywhere, spreading faster than wildfire. Um, we have come to you to ask for a favor. Nice. You know, um, other people come to you for money. But, but we are not here for money. At all. We are here for you to show us the way, how to make big money like you. That's why we are here, senior. So I want you to help us. <laughs> okay. <coughs> oh. We're from the same place, hmm? same town, makes us brothers. The way I know is very simple. Identify your strength, find what you're good at, and keep doing it. Focus on it, right? Don't give up. Most of all, be good to people and believe in God. Your time will come. Um, Senor, that's true. 
But as a matter of fact, we've identified our strengths. But it's not really working the way we expected. Most time when a deal is about to mature, then but that will suddenly become wise, I would pay. Sometimes the EFCC and police disturb the flow of our business. So that's why I've come for you to help us as a senior man in the field. Oh yes, senior man. Last month, they raided our camp and seized all our phones and laptop. We paid through our nose to get those things back. Exactly. Hmm? They even flashed our phones before giving them back to us. So, so that's why we are here. That's why we are here to, for you to show us how to protect ourselves. Can we blow the hook again? Can <coughs> I've listened to you. And I think I understand where you people are coming from. I understand what you want me to do for you. And I, I now know what you do for a living. Yahoo. Yeah, it's so cool. Yeah, I job You know, as a matter of fact, that's the trendy business now. Mm. Yes. It's trendy now. Go, go. But it's fraud, actually. It's, it's, uh, it's 419. Sometimes uh, you people make it look like it's legit business and give it all sorts of funny names, but it's fraud. Fraud is fraud. It's 419. It's fraud. Uh, it will be good for you people to listen to me. I took my time to listen to you. You're my brothers, my younger brothers. So please listen. I don't do fraud. Yes, I'm not into Yahoo. I'm not into any kind of business that will attract the attention of the police or the EFCC. No, I'm not. I own Tigana Group. Tigana group of companies, uh, Tigana hotels, Tigana clubs. We have branches in Portacot, Abuja, and Lagos. I'm also into importation of goods. I import different goods and sell. And I, I'm into wines as well, exotic wines. I'm into different businesses, but all of them are legit. All my businesses are legit. I don't do things that will make the police come after me or EFCC. I don't do rituals. And I'll tell you, when you people go to do these things, you do you know, rituals and all that, ask the uh, native doctors, ask them, why, why are they poor? Their children should be richer than all of you, but it's never like that. It means those things don't work. Right? So that's what I do. Like I said before, identify your strength, focus on it. Keep doing it. Keep working hard. Believe in God and keep helping people. Your time will come. A big alanga alanga. I know you can still help us. Eh? Because we see now, yeah, can see from point zero, we get to point seventy-five. At least, can solo men in the MIF. Eh? We know you can at least help us. But can I have one name, Odogu? Odogu have a guy name. Oh yes. <laughs> well, I'm willing to help you people. Like you said, you're my brothers. I mean, if if you know me very well, you know that I I help people for a living. You know, I believe in raising others. That's I mean, that's 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 me. But you must be ready to serve. I served my boss for seven years, then I learned the business. So you want to be with me, you must be ready to serve. And be ready to do legit business, like I said, clean business. Then again, my company um, we'll be recruiting. Yes, we have vacancy for jobs. So if you're ready, send in your CVs. We have spaces for marketing managers and all that. So, in fact, now you've met me. It means that once your qualification is intact, you have the jobs. Um, senior, from all indication, you are trying to hide your things from us. We know you, Manezio. You might want to stand in by and pass it by the more fifty. Cha cha do it. Dorime, I will come money for civil servants. Manezio, you need to go back to the location to do Oh, do go move it. Do go can effect off. Matu to pass it go. I don't put it in the fan now. Guys, you are here. The man who go money in the only tree that form evil forest. Only single tree. Okay, nene. Form the forest. Oh, don't go. Oh, don't go I'm calling to report a crime to your commission. 
Did you see what this young man, Digana, did in my town recently? Why is he not arrested by now? His money is legitimate? Says who? Who investigated it? Your chairman was present at the event? Really? Uh, then I don't have need to talk to you. Thank you. Chinigeme. The head of a crime fighting agency attending an occasion organized by a criminal? But this country. This country is finished. This country is finished. Given the busy. Can you find you? Yeah. Feel good, you go everywhere. Take it easy. Small boy. Small boy. Take it easy. Don't make it this not a from the look of things, the issue of making a Kokalia Digwe must be reconsidered. Hmm. I I've been thinking so too, uh, but the question is uh, who will do it? Agukalia has bought over all our elders. So, if the matter comes to a vote, who will vote against Agukalia? You, besides you and I and Okaf, who else? Don't be too sure. From what Nemeka has done and is still doing for our community, mm. no right thinking person would consider. Akukalia for Igwe. Hmm. Akukalia has clearly shown that he is just a Shylock trying to milk our people dry. Hmm. He is not yet Igwe, but he is annexing our community land. So, what happens if he becomes one? Oh no, your guess is as good as mine. Hmm. Look, uh, this matter is on the lips of everybody in this community. But the question is, how do we approach it? How? How do you prevent Akokala from becoming the Igwe? It looks very difficult to me, if not impossible. It is not impossible. The only foreseeable problem is if Namika will even accept or be interested in becoming the Eagle. Mm. Besides, he is not married. Mm. The issue of marriage to me is not a major hindrance. Yes, our tradition does not specify that an Igwe designate must be married. Although it is better that he is. You are correct. Mm -hmm. You are correct. Mm. So the so major challenge is, is if Nemeka will even accept, accept to be Igwe. Right. It's a major one. It's a major challenge. That young man seems to like you a lot. You can say that again. He respects me a lot. I tried so much to defend him and his mother, when let Ibekwe was maltreating them and eventually sent them away. Mm. So that explains it. That really explains it. Um, I, I, I know they went through so much trauma. Ibekwe. <sighs> so, why don't you talk to Nemeka about this matter? Hmm? Yes. Why don't you go to Lagos, sit him down, and explain this matter to him that we need him as our Igwe. 
explain the implication of having Akokalia as our Igwe. Let us save our community from future disaster by getting Akokalia out of the way. And the only option we have is that young man, Nemeka. Don't worry. I will provide the logistics for the trip. And I will stand by you every step of the way. But you know, by virtue of my position as they know, I cannot come out in the open. I'm supposed to be neutral. Think about it. We can do it. We can save this community from future disaster by getting Akokale out of the way. Nemeka seems to be the only one. Here. Take it easy. To be a king is not a daughter. Chief Akokale. Guy man. Take it easy. Alright, daddy. I'll see you later. Where are you going to? Daddy, I'm going out. I want to chill with my friends. Go back inside. Daddy, why? I just want anger with my friends. I'm spending my money. It's not like I'm asking you for money. Get back inside. Daddy, I want to hang out with my friends. Call them and tell them that he says you should be indoor. Oh, Daddy, I want to hang out with my friends, Daddy. Get really addressed. You are in bulletin bag. Daddy, you know, you know you're you're an old man. I'm younger. I need to look good. You know I'm your princess daddy, so I'll see you later, daddy. I have to look good for you, daddy. See you later. I love you, daddy. You're welcome, my other. Oh, thank you, Nemeka. So good to have you in my office. I'm happy to see you again. <laughs> After the last time you visited. Oh, it was wonderful. <laughs> thank you, our worthy and illustrious son. We will go straight to the point because I know you don't have the luxury of time. Our people are about to make Chifa Kokalia the Igwe. And if that happens, Nemeka, we are done for. We are done for. Akokalia is a wicked man. He wants to use the position of the Igwe to oppress and subdue our people rather than uplift our, our people. No has to come with me. Because our people say that the snake seen by one person easily becomes a python. I'm going to ask you to go to the phone. I'm going to go to the That's why I had to. It's part of the fact that by virtue of my office, I'm supposed to be neutral on such matters. But this is very important to us. That's why I volunteered to come along with him. Uh, <coughs> I've heard about Akukalia, Chief Akukalia. Yes, I have heard about him. And I'm just wondering what can be done about the situation. But you people are the elders, uh, kingmakers, stakeholders. Can't you refuse making him king and choose someone else who is worthy? That's exactly why we are here. Oh, good, good. So such a man uh, shouldn't be king uh, at all, at all. A greedy man. No, no, no. I don't support him. Uh, show me any man you feel is worthy. You know, a good man who has leadership qualities, you know, who will lead the people right. So I'll, I'll give him my support. I promise. <laughs> The good news is that we have chosen someone else. Oh, great. <laughs> so, mm. so who is he? Um, that new person whom we consider to be worthy to be the Igwe of Umudim. That person is seated right here with us. In this my office? Yes. You should have told me that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Luka is the new king. You should have told me. Yeah, <laughs> Mecca. Nemeka, mm -hmm. that somebody else we have chosen is none other than you. Of course. Yes. You, Nemeka Maduka, is our chosen candidate. Me? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you must be joking. Jo joking? How can we come all the way from Malibo to Lagos to joke. I have a lagunasa, Milnasa, Cholo Gibiana Lagos. You see that we are joking. We are not joking. 
That's serious. Oh God. Uh, Nemeka, listen to me. We have the consent of the most worthy of Nietzsche and the elders yes. to consult you on this matter. And the understanding is that the moment you say yes, Chief Akukalia ceases to be a candidate yes. for the position of Igwe. Take this very seriously. Unfortunately, I say no. Sorry to disappoint you, but I say no. It's not my thing. Find someone else. Huh? A good man. Someone who has you know, the knowledge of how these things work. A good man with leadership qualities, someone who resides in the village and understand the workings. Point, uh, you know, at that person and say, "This is the man." I'll, I'll support him. Believe me, I will. But for me, no. Come on, God has blessed me with, you know, talent for business. He's given me the grace for what I'm doing, and that's what I want to keep doing. I don't want to confuse myself with something I know nothing about. So from my side, I say no. Don't give us a wrong zone now. Okay. He said, think. Hey, no. Hey, boy, you going on? Hey, boy, you going on? Where are you? Where are you? Get that guy! Get that guy! I know you've been the last person to come outside. I know you must be the last person to come outside. Anyways, I just wanted to make this very clear to you. As you can see, this very house has been from that time to return and plot. You can see very, 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 very clear. You have only two weeks, in fact, one week, to vacate, yeah, to pack your dirty things, poverty, wretched life out of my house. Oh, Let me oh, make a proper usage of my investment. Oh, no, no, yeah. uh, um, caretaker, do you have anything to say? Yes, no, of, of course. You know, I'm the caretaker of this house. At least you would have notified us now, at least three months' notice. Huh? Even four months. Huh? What's all this now? <laughs> what kind of information? What of one year? No, no, I am sorry. No. I am sorry. And please, yeah. I made a mistake. Next time, I will give you one year. Yeah, one year to pack your life out of my house because now Papa build house for me. Now Papa build house for me. Do you know how much a bag of cement is cost? Go on. Anybody want to stay should be paying daily lodging. <laughs> Correct, manager. Um, um, uh, listen, 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 listen. I, I wanted to give you this grace, uh, even if you are still owing me, you, should, you can still go with it. I don't need it. I'm, I'm dealing on ego dolime. Why don't? Uh, Naza. I don't mean uh, civil servant. So all of you are poor, wretched civil servant. I can only help you if you want to lodge. You can be paying daily instead of rent. Uh, from now henceforth, it's no more. It's no longer rent. Yeah, hotel lodging. Uh, hotel lodging. That's what you'll be paying. Yeah, okay. Day, uh, I, I, I am. I am the new manager. Tell them. <laughs> Sorry, I almost forgot. Uh -huh. Uh, from now as forth, he's my manager. Yes, you are not yeah, you see, caretaker. You have no you have no mouth, you have nothing to say in this very case. Now as forth, he's now the manager. From today, he'll be taking care of everything uh, concerning these premises. Huh? Uh, 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 landlord, landlord. Don't you the only person where, where don't build that for, uh, uh, for, uh, for uh, this premises? Uh, 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 what kind of nonsense is this? Don't mind them. Anyways. I do not have time to waste with wretched, poor, fool, useless, unless you youth like you. If you fail to comply to this notice, I will have no option than to arrest you with the police. We are not afraid of anybody. I, even if people are afraid, I'm not afraid of you. Let me go. 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 I'm not afraid of any police. Hello. Hello. Mm -hmm. DPO. Mm -hmm. Yeah, now your boy, the talk, sir. Mm -hmm. uh, please come to that, my friend's house with yeah, your Bato, squad. Bato, Bato. Mr. Bato. Uh, Bato. Come Bato. to his Bato. house. And if they are coming, make sure they are with ammunition. There are some touts, some area boys here. In fact, unknown gunmen. Yeah, who are who them mother everywhere. Hoodlums everywhere. Yeah, hoodlums. They are here trying to harass everybody here. <laughs> so please send them and come and clear all these people here. Amodika. I want to stay now. No, come. Come on, there are no young men that are prepared. Uh, in fact, are you going? No, are you still there? Are you still there? No, 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 no,
Uh, manager, oh. manager. Oh. You can now continue from here. Eh? Tell the people. Tell, tell, the them, public. tell them. Tell them. Tell everyone that Batola, Batola, Batola is here. Batola has arrived. Hey, yes. <laughs> Our we, club is set. Let's turn the mic. One, two. Let's turn the mic. One, two. Hello, everybody. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, yes. Hear and hear me clear. Come, let's go and let it. We are live and direct we have made it. at <laughs> Bato's <laughs> Hotels <laughs> and Club. Yeah. Keep that just there. Where the Dorima is happening. Where Amina is happening. <laughs> Now, Dorime, Dorime is not for civil servant. We want Ego Dorime. Make them bring Ego Dorime. Hello! He said, Dorime is not for civil servant. That Ebo Ego Dorime can hear If you don't have Ego Dorime, I mean a bunch of money, dollars, don't come to Bato's hotels and clubs. Correct. <laughs> because here, we have different kinds of dishes. We have intercontinental dishes. We have Local dishes. Yeah, maybe. We have toke. Plenty. We have pomo. Wow. We have uh uh oguroko. Amino, 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 amino plenty. Amino. Okay, we have amino the plenty. We have it all around. We have whiskies. We have beers. We have anything. Oh my no kuya. Oh my sir. Okay, babes. <laughs> we have babes. Only we have the kuku katapila. Morning can we have pomoniru? All of them are here. Tell them, tell them, tell they are here left and right. Tell them that Batu, Batu uh, Hotel and Club is now the best. It, 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 very soon, um, uh, Memeka Tigana will be our boy. Uh -huh. Batu Hotels and Club is the best <laughs> in this town. Very, very soon, Memeka Tigana will be answering us. Sir, yes. what can we do for you? you know? Sir, can I clean your shoe? <laughs> Sir, come, come, come. Oh, 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 we don't want boy. A maker together will be small boy like me, our boy boy. Will be our boy boy. So here, everything is in quantity. Very, very, very big. Very, very gigantic. See, see, whatever you are, carry your girlfriend, come. <laughs> carry anybody. In our bed, we are going to No more credit. Not ego civil servants. Not civil huh? servants. No, they should not bring ego salary, ego civil servants. They should bring ego yahoo, ego mpp. I'm um, um, Listen to me, listen to me. Don't ever call my number again, okay? If you don't have anything good to say, don't call me. I don't have time for silly conversations. Don't call me again. Ah, <sighs> okay, niggas. Hello? Who is this? Who? Oh, who's this? It's Odinaka, your baby. Oh my god! Odinaka, you're back? I flew into Lagos yesterday. And right now, I'm in the village. You mean you're in this village? Just to see you. <laughs> you can't beat that. Oh, you're so romantic. I love you, baby. I love you so much. So tell me, where are you right now? Um, you know, you know this new hotel in town, La, La Visco? That's where I am. Okay, I'll be with you. I'll be with you right now. I'm coming. <laughs> okay, I can't wait to see you. I got to your favorite. <laughs> Oh, you're so sweet. Don't worry, I'll be with you in a jiffy. I know, I know. I miss you so much, you know. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, okay, so. Um... Oh my goodness! Ah! Oh, like he's back. Ah! <laughs> Wow, 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 wow. Yo, <laughs> ah! <laughs> go, 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 hey, hey, oh, hey, I'm coming down, we're going down, hey, yeah, 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 ooh, hey, I'm 
What is it? Mommy, I am so happy. You know, I feel like I'm on top of the world. All right. Now tell me. I can see it. What's going on? Mom, you know this American guy I told you about? He just arrived. Yes. Hold on. The one from this town. Yes, Odinaka. He came all the way from America to see me. Now let me tell you this. Mommy, we met on Facebook. And then we started chatting. Suddenly he said, he's in love with me. You know, but I was like, one of the usual lies that guy is there. But then, he's here. He came all the way from America to see me. Hold on. And you are dressed to go and see him? Yes, mom. To see him? Of course. Like this? <laughs> I hope you are wearing panty panty. No! <laughs> now calm down. Why don't you ask him to come over to this place instead? Oh, um, mom, no, 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 no. So that daddy will embarrass him for me. No, let me go see him face to face. And then after. Adora, I need you to be very careful. Should anything happen to you now, it is me that your father will blame. Yes. <laughs> Mommy, nothing will happen to me. All the places I've been going to, did you escort me? All right, all right, all right, chill. You don't sound like you are too desperate. Come on. Girl. Yes, mom, I am desperate. And he is desperately in love with me. Oh, I am such a lucky girl. Adora. Ah, God. You will not leave this house like this, oh. Mommy, are you going to tie me? Ah! <laughs> my bag, my bag, my bag. <laughs> I'm coming. Adora, you are too much. Babe, where's Sabi? Ah, I'm such a lucky girl. Oops. Okay. Let me snap a selfie. Oops. I look so good. Oh, did I get? Here I come. If I had started this hotel and club business earlier before now, I would have been competing with Tejana. Now look at me. 
and I was busy wasting my time with those useless poor wretched tenants. Now we could not even pay the rent after after the first year. Baba, I'm okay. You know the sweetest thing. Mm -hmm. One of my friends mm -hmm. that started this hotel business. Mm -hmm. the guy don't hammer. Yeah, you don't mean it. When I tell you hammer, real money. But you, <laughs> in this club and hotel business, now they are the main rappers thing. Okay, Ego na kwasa. Now means. Ego pala. I am on point. Ego mada ni ni dayana. You are on point right now. I'm telling you the fact. If any na do go work please. Mala won't keep back on yon. For bulunze. Nya nze no beer. You need something else? That's not even more me today. Fuck, what's happening? There's not no meat on your plate. Don't worry. What is this? Manager! That guy is too dumb. Am I liking him? Will you, will you, will you, will you come here? Uh, Hello. Uh, what do you mean when I call you? You move your body like it might be like a man. Shut up! What do you mean by eh? Can't you answer, sir? Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Uh, when I call you, you run like a mad dog. Nah, mad tiger! Money is talking! Uh, uh, sorry, uh, okay. don't be angry. What can I do for you? You are done. There is no meat on the plate. And you ask me a question. Do you, do you, can you say enough meat on this plate? My friend, will you, will you take that plate and, and refresh, refresh the meat? Oh, God, is talking. Oh, 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 you know, there's a general saying that you don't come to the house of a king empty handed. So I came with this. Thank you. Thank you. So, whose son are you? I'm the son of Chief Mbakwe from Umuda. Mbakwe. Umuda. The one who used to trade in Aba and later moved his business to Lagos? Yes, yes, sir, you're correct. Ah, very hard working man, Ezbo Mado. Ah, and you live in America? Yes, I've been in America for a while now. That's wonderful. Huh? You and my daughter are a perfect match. <laughs> yes, you see, when we were in Lagos, many men, engineers, doctors, lawyers, architects, were coming for her hand in marriage. But I said, no. She must marry from our stock. Ah. Because I knew Abundibo were a special people. <laughs> yeah? And it has happened like that. <laughs> uh, thank you very much, Chief. I... Myself and your daughter, we really love ourselves, genuinely. I see. <laughs> well, it's, uh, like I said, it's wonderful. Huh? It's um, a thing that uh, is approved. You have my consent already. Because, see that, my daughter. Yes, sir. She's a beauty queen. Very wonderful. If I be to you and me, you know, as men, any time they come to look, at, look for her here, I don't allow all these antelopes and elephant to corrupt her. She's still a virgin. <laughs> so you are a very lucky man. Ooh, I'm, I'm very happy, Chief. Who wouldn't be? <laughs> you are going to be. Are you not aware you are going to be the son-in-law of the Igbo of the town? She could be that. Uh -huh. She could be that. Do you know what it means to be married to a daughter of an Igwe, yeah. a princess? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, but you see, mm, you have to be very fast. Each time I'm coming out of this premises, I'll see cars, exotic cars parked. So, do you have a So, this uh, goods, non a sight. If you waste time, on your have a <laughs> no, I won't do that. <laughs> um, Chief, see, I'll call with my family, the King's Men, in two weeks' time. Uh, I believe that is that is not in much of time. Um, you must be fast about it. 
My daughter was on the side. Thank you very much, Chief. You go to Lazy Bar Fan Abem. Thank you, Chief. This um, it's good to know that young people like you are doing well in America. You have to talk to your daughter seriously. If she allows this golden opportunity to miss, <laughs> it will be like the proverbial snail picked by the blind man. If she misses this young man because of her bad character, she will remain in this house with you and me forever. My daughter doesn't have a bad character. Sorry. Like the mother, like daughter. Oh, like daughter, like father, you mean? Why is it that when a child is bad, automatically it will become her mother's fault? But when that child is good, oh, is her father's. That is your business. I have done my bit as a father. You saw how I praised her, packaged her, promoted her, that even the devil was saying, it's that Adora that are describing. I played my part very well. If she goes there to expose herself, she will come back to you. Oh, to die, praise I've heard you. Thank you. Now listen to me. There's something I want to tell you. Very important. You know, this world we live in is full of evil and envy. Please keep this information low, as low as possible. All right? Yeah, you know, till he finally marries you. That's it. You know, your fellow girls, those hovering around you, claiming to be your friends. Before you know it, they would want to take this man away from you. And I wouldn't <laughs> want that. Mom, no damn girl can try that. Take my Odinaka from me. Do they know how I got him? Well, oh, come on. Well, I'm just trying here to give you motherly advice. Mm. They gossip a lot here. Believe me, before you know it, you know, they will start telling him this and that about you, and I wouldn't want that. Mom, 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 you're right about this. You won't believe that stupid girl, Adana. She has been asking me silly questions. Hey, Holania. <sighs> Have you seen it? Did you tell me this before now? Oh. Which is why you need to be very careful. Extremely careful. It's okay, Mom. I will keep it on the low until I get the ring. And then they will know that Adora has a right. Mama. They will not say level, past level. Mama. Well, you know your daughter now. I see the horse. I trust you. <laughs> keep talking to him nicely. Be nice to him. You know what I'm talking about. It's okay, mom. Just, you know, uh, do not boast of anything. Um, Don't. It's okay, mom. It's under control. And I wouldn't want you to argue with him. Not just like the way your father used to argue with me. <laughs> Mom, no problem. I will handle him. Mom. What is You it? know, I love you. I love you much more. You are a good mother. Say it again. <laughs> You're a good mother. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Take this one, eh? Take Obodi. Odinaka gave me $4,000. That's like more than what my stingy dad has given to me my entire life. Goodness! Don't mind your stingy daddy. Hold on, hold on. $4,000 US dollars. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Nekute $4,000! Yes! <laughs> and you're just giving me this? Oops. My daughter, can't you see? You look somehow like your father in stinginess. Okay, I think I'll have to take it back. 
Oh, no. no, give me back. Mba, no. Have you seen this kind of money before? Has your stingy husband ever given you this sort of money? Do not mind your daddy. I told you he's blessed with stinginess. Stingy. Super stingy, mom. Extremely, and you look like him. <laughs> Anyways, have forgiven dad for coordinating himself the way he did in presence of Odinaka. Mom, I was super surprised. Like, he said so many nice things about me that I am a good girl. But that's how it should be. I'm a good girl. You are indeed a good girl. You are just like your mother. <laughs> You know, <laughs> in beauty, stinginess, like your Mom, friend. I'm not stingy. Mm. You know what? If you keep being good, more dollars for you. I will. Don't be like that. Get out. That man is stingy. You're like your is stingy. <laughs> I don't want too much. Eh? I don't want this cutter, please. Hey, God. Hey. America husband. Who dares me? My daughter is having her traditional wedding on 10th of next month. I want you to make sure all the preparations are top notch. Can you handle it? Yes, I can handle it. I'm a professional event planner. Good. My friends are coming from all over the world. America, India, China, Bangladesh, Singapore, Sweden. Huh? So, um... I want it to be bigger than that here, this small boy. And make a Tigana, who you people saw and thought you had seen anything. Now you see the real money flying from up to down. Wow. Eh? Don't disappoint me. Oh. Yes, I won't disappoint you. Okay. We don't have time, so let's get on with it. All right, sir. So I have the deal here with me. You want to do Three point five million. Yes, sir. That is the point. For what? Are you the one to buy the food and drinks? Sir, I will be the one to provide the cooling van, the canopies, chairs, and other accessories. Madam, madam, this is too much now. Huh? Come down. All right, sir. I can only come down to three point four million naira. Yes, madam. Look at. 3.4 million naira. Event planning. K4. What is there in event planning? Is it not to put a uh, ice block here? Put canopy here? Buy drink? Put it to call food people? I'm also an event planner. Look, madam. If you are not taking 200,000 naira, forget it. I mean, this is, this is a joke. Sir, that is the last price. 3.4 million naira. Last price? Yes, sir. You can go. Uh-uh. What nonsense. You can't take 200,000 naira, forget it. I go, I go, I do it, my, I do it myself. I'm a member of the LMI, no, you go ahead, Harold. You go, you can go, please. You don't know who you can do. You can't plan it. Go to my, go to my, go to my, go to my, I was even too generous with 200,000 naira. Are you done with my dad? Yeah, we are done. But he said the bill I gave him is much, that he's just going to pay 200k. Oh, oh, madam, please, pay no attention to my dad. My husband has provided all the money. He just wants to pocket it and, and ruin my wedding. That's not possible. No. Come in. No, Let's no, talk no, 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 no. I don't think I will continue with this. No. Come on, madam. It's my wedding. Money is not the problem. Let's go in and I will talk to him. And if he still insists, I will call my husband. Let's go in. Hey, Mecca, you cannot use and dump me. No, I will resist by all and any means. This is not a case of using and dumping anyone. Our relationship is no longer working, and you know it. How is the relationship not working? Tell me. Oh, oh, oh. So, because I refuse to serve you as a housemaid, therefore the relationship is not working, right? It's not a problem. We are not compatible. All right? We don't share the same values, we don't share the same thinking, we don't, we don't share anything, nothing. And then we quarrel virtually all the time, every day. Okay, look at it right now, we're just coming from a function. Okay, it's supposed to be a romantic function for couples. But look at what you're doing. 
You're already nagging. You're quarreling. Can we just end this thing before somebody kills the other person? No problem. If you're going to break up with me, you're going to compensate me with at least half of your net worth for wasting my time. Excuse me? Half of what? Yes, you heard me right. Half of my, my, my net worth? What are you talking about? Are we married? Oh, so we have to be married before you compensate me, right? I know the law. There's no such compensation for a fiancé. There isn't. I built this business with you. And you think you can just throw me out? Excuse me? What business are you talking about? My business or your father's business? Huh? Let me remind you, Queen, that before we got close, before we became intimate, you were my, my, my legal advisor. And every legal work that you did for my company, you were paid up till this moment. Never owned for one day. And then I bought you a car worth over 10 million naira. Is it a lie? I've been paying your very high rent, high maintenance, in our galaxy monument. What the, what the bloody rubbish are you talking about? That's enough. You want to break up with me, right? Yes. You want to break up? Fine. Just stop recounting those nonsense. Just, that's enough. I'm done. never going to work. We are so incompatible. There's no way I'll live with this for the rest of my life. There's no way I'll live with this all the days of my life. It's better she leaves. Let her go. Yes, yes. Where are the drinks and the meat I asked you to bring for me? Uh, Oga, I cannot supply another drinks and meat here. Why? Actually, you are owning the company a huge amount of money. Me? Yes, sir. Uh, Oga, sorry. Look at this list now. This list is something you and your friend consume under the space of one week Ngwongo, that is for pesu fifty thousand naira toke eighty thousand naira Okuruko. that one is thirty five thousand uh beer beer is uh fifty five thousand spirit and the total bill here is 350,000 naira. In fact, including the ones some guests will come and collect things in your name. So, Abia, that one alone is 80,000 naira. Yes, you are very stupid. Some girls came here and collected something in my name. And you gave it to them without collecting money? Uh, okay, I always come and seek permission from you. Uh, anytime I came here and seek for your permission, and you ask me, as long as they are guests, not be here when I or something like that, I should give them. Sir, in fact, neighbor, no need back. Neighbor, that you are on top of the money. Sir, that is the thing, no? You are, you are a lousy manager. Eh? You are a very stupid manager. Hey. Even if I say give them, can't you use your senses? What kind of a manager like you? What makes me, oh my God, what makes you my manager? Um, wait, 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 wait. wait a minute. If they ask you to bring, you bring. If they ask you to water, you water. Imagine. And I say when you bring, you bring. Bring that bell. The one makes you a manager. What makes you a manager? Obama. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You are an idiot. You idiot. Bunch of idiots. You know, take it. You move far back. You feel. Sorry for you. You know what? Mm. <laughs> one of these days, mm. I will kick you out of this. Hey, I'll be Come on, you can get for me the drinks and that I said you pay for me. Uh, uh, okay. How about the money of this one? Can you pay me now? Mr. Master, what's up with this man? What's up with this man? Come on, come on. Why did you kick you up on your Look at this useless guy. In my own company. What are you doing? My whole hard-earned money. 
I a salary in this month, I really do. What are you doing? If the case is not taken, if I do not take it for part, look at this very guy. He's going to want to be a man. Kick his ass off. I'm going to be a team theory. I'm not going to be a man for civil servants. He doesn't know, man. I'm not going to be a man. Where is he now? Adora. Daddy. Adabeke. Daddy. Wano. Oh, moon nagin eba. Ndi moodim. Well, Maya. Ye go say any onya on his nogabo. I'm not gonna lie. 
What is going on? Where? How? Wait, you're not aware that Odnaka is back from America? <laughs> you must be joking. Enough of this joke. My own Odin. How can Odinaka come back and I didn't know? <laughs> you must be joking. As I speak to you now, Odnaka is getting married to Akokalia's daughter. That we want Adora. Kilichi, tell me it's not true. You, you're joking, right? Oh. You think I came here to joke? I will leave my house to come here and joke with you. I was passing by and I overheard noises from Akokalia's compass. So I decided to go and check what was happening. Wait, let me show you something. Is this... Is this not Adnaka? I'll be there now too. 
Kelly, this is my Odinaka. This is Odinaka, Kelly. Wait, you're not aware. Kelly. I'm even as confused as you are. Kelly, wait. Kelly, this is Come back. Kelly, 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 The money we pay for this Akokaria is fake. Fake money. This one is fake. Look at it. All the money is fake. Can you imagine that? Nice. You. This money is not a good citizen. No. Eh? I was thinking that this money is a philanthropist. Learn. Just look at it. One leg on your see. This is fake money. This money is of no use for me. Do you know the Nelly arrested us at that shop when we went to buy wine? Yes. Because of fake money. Yes, now. Eh? It's a criminal offense. One day, 20 years imprisonment, too. That is what the carrier wants us to go in. Nah, hey. eh. He is not a good citizen. In short, this money is of no use for me. In short, I will try work. No, 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 no. Don't, don't even you dare it. This money can see, be see, what you're going to do right now, let's go to divine power. That prophet. Divine genie. That power, that, that the prophet that is reigning now. Let's go see if you can change this money to see, reach I you. Can't you. Can't you. My boy, no, for you, Just look at it. Everything about this money is fake. Fake! If you don't mind. My boy, no phone here, that no devil. Abukaria is not. My phone here, can't do it. Everything about this is fake. I don't know. I'm going to make you three points. Kill me, Jim. So after this, you know, the Naka, I'm waiting for him for seven good years. But Naka left me and married another girl. Simply because she's a rich man's daughter, I am a daughter of a nobody. Don't say that. Uh, so all of that. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> Tell me why did God give me the burden that I cannot carry? Why? God has nothing to do with this. <laughs> Don't tell me that. Don't tell me that. He has everything to do with it. Oh God! Why me now? Why me now? You understand how? Well, you know, this life is not really as sweet. Oh God! Hmm? Listen, <laughs> listen, look at me. God is preparing something for me. What can God simply be preparing for me? I have lost all the chances I have. You I have lost it all. Oh. You have not. <laughs> I will always be here for you. <laughs> I did it with Naka. After the him, right? I even gave him money that he traveled with. And this is all I've got. This is it, right? This is it. I just pray that God would get me out of this thing. I am tired. I'm tired. Why me? Why me? Why would I not do this to me? Tell me why. Kelly, do I deserve this? You don't. Nobody deserves it. I don't deserve it, right? So why did he do it to me? Why? Why me? I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. Did I do anything to him? Oh. 
Ay, que yo no sé si amo usted. Thank you very much for the color. Uh, my brother, or better still, my son, please do not be offended that I'm back to you on the same mission. Our people say that where a child is crying and pointing fingers, if his mother is not there, his father must be there. You will not like what will become of our town if Akukalia becomes the next Igwe. You will regret not accepting this offer. Akukalia is a wicked man. In fact, a direct opposite of you. Uh, I, I, uh, I don't even know what to say. I've already received Akukalia's invitation card. And if I'm not mistaken, the ceremony should be holding in Maybe a month or so. So, uh, how do we change things? What, what's this talk about? Akukalia can distribute invitation cards even to the president. But we are to decide if it will happen or not. Mm. Oh. <coughs> it's you, Nduka. I know you like me a lot. And of course, I, <laughs> I like the fact that you like me and you would want me to become king. But let's be realistic. Before a man like Akokalia would go ahead and start printing cards and sharing to different people, there must have been an agreement between him and the kingmakers, you know, the, the, the elders. And um, in you as a person, no matter how much you want to change things, it's virtually impossible. <laughs> On my own part, I don't live in the village. I've never been king. I don't understand, you know, how the workings of the palace and all these things. So how, how, do, we, how do we do it? That is why people like us are there. We will teach and guide you on the thinness of your institution. You already have the personality, the large heart and the goodwill. As for not living in the village, that is not a problem at all. Many Igwes are residing outside the communities. It's not like before where you must be on ground always. I can give you some examples of Igwes that are operating from where they are. Igwe Zoranya resides in Abuja. Igwe Okanume stays in Lagos. Igwe Omekoku is in Kaduna. They still coordinate the activities of their communities from there. That's not going to be a problem. Igwe, Igwe, the Kaduna was always a wee Igwe. Yeah. I'll, 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 uh, I'll think about it and get back. Hmm? Of course. I'll think about it. Of course. It's just that there, uh, there, there's no, no time again. I'll think about it. Ah, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Ah, so, so if I'm, did you not see me? See you, so what? So what? You think I don't hear all you and your friends do about the town gossiping about me and you claim to be a high class sweetheart and you're trekking under the sun, sweating, eh? Odinaka, what have I done to you? And what gossip are you talking about? I'm sure you don't know what have ears. I hear every little thing you say about me and my lovely princess. Uh -huh. I said, yes. Odinaka. What have come over you? What has no, come tell me. Over you? What? What has come over me? Now I'm going to warn you for the last time. Stay away from me and my sweetheart. Okay? And I'll shock all of you. I'm going to give you the surprise of your life. I'll take my princess outside this country and leave all of you to keep gossiping with your low life. Okay, fine. Classless thing like you. Oh, 
Which <coughs> embargo? Our mas my masquerade group, Akwebilisi, mm. is ready. I'm very much prepared for the coronation of Igwe. I trust you. <laughs> Only what we are asking is for some money to be given to us. So that we shall prepare for the big occasion, which I know is, will be an epoch making one. Of course it will be. Uh, but, um, Chiemba, no. No, such requests should go to Akokale. Yes. He is the one being coronated. Um, he is expected to foot the bills. Definitely it will go to Akokalia. But you are going to do it yourself. Me? Yes. You know he's a very difficult man. I do not want him to insult me. Especially where he doesn't feed me and my family. Besides, I'm thinking how we are going to cope with him when he becomes Iwe. Uh, it's a bag. No. Mm, we are all worried. Even me here, I am worried. Ha. Oh no, we don't be worried though. We are banking on you and the rest of other Iches to control him so that we can get the best of his contacts. Instead of him using those contacts to intimidate and molest us. Exactly. Exactly. That is our own thinking too. But um, we know it's going to be a tough battle. I will not expect Akukala to change overnight. It's going to be a tough battle. But we know that God will help us. Amen. Amen. Akwilili. Ochora. Omen ampo mokoma. Yes, I'm very well, my friend. <laughs> I will soon join your league of uh, Ndigwe. Yes, I'll be crowned in about three weeks. <laughs> Everything is fine. It's going on very well. I'm just calling to inform you before I send an invitation. <laughs> yes. It's always good making it in the city and coming to rule over them in the village. <laughs> yes, I'll be expecting you on that day. Kano Kalyan, Mokoma, Onyike. But I believe I can have a club. I'm going to go to the All right. Dalo Mokem, Dalo. I'll be expecting you. Bolo crowd behind you. I Baby, baby, baby. Thank you. Take a look at this. I know you've got eyes for good things. What about this? Isn't this dress beautiful? It is. Well, a friend of mine wants to buy it for me from London. It's for our coronation. But I've already bought clothes for our coronation. I do not like that dress. No, it makes me look old. I do not want to get old. All right, sweetheart. Listen, I want to be a yopi lolo. I do not want to get old. Come on, believe me. Why don't hmm? you get back to your mama's belly and become like Nicodemus, be born again, start afresh? What do you mean by that, honey? You bought three different clothes for yourself. You are a man. What do you need it for? And you bought just one miserable dress for me. The very one that makes me look like an old woman. Mbano. But you are an old woman. I am not. <laughs> I am the one to be crowned, not you. If you want new clothes, buy with your money. Story. Story. More. I have already sent Ngozi to buy the clothes for me and you are going to pay. Aspiring 
stingy Igwe. Whether you like it or not, it's a secret fact, Ija. Foolish woman. It's your foolishness that caused you to give me those children. Your son is abroad speaking for me. Can't pass one exam. Your daughter has gone out. Thank God the man who doesn't know her came to collect her. Any day he comes here to complain. I think the best thing that can happen to me after this coronation is to take a new wife. Somebody can take care of me. I am massaging. No disakaliogori. Ola busigonanya. Don't even know who you are. Your people won't work. You can't even know who you are. They are your people. I am surprised. I am surprised. Yes. Oh no, what yeah. coming this late? I hope all is well. Awada bose filankiti. Awada bose filankiti. You come near Kunle. Oh no, if any one of you has gone after. There's good news. Huh? There is good news. Tell me. 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 Hey. Hmm. Hmm. Hey. So, how do we manage this? How do we solve this problem? What? The whole town is agog with the uh, Aquacalia's preparation for for the coronation, for his coronation. He has sent out invitation cards to all our Sunday to everywhere. How do we manage that? If Akukalia likes, let him send invitation even to the president of America. A failed courtship is better than a failed marriage. Osi fele, makali ladi fele. Akukalia cannot make himself king. We are still the kingmakers, and we still have the final say on this matter. Hmm. You have a point. You have a point, Jenduka. But um, my worry is greedy and treacherous people like Isok. How do we make this thing work with people like them? It won't be easy, but it will be done. It must be done. We only need to give it deep thinking. We just need to give it deep thinking. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Uh, if if I an emelo mo fair. If an emelo mo fair. Hello. Yeah. Once again, you're welcome. Thank you. You don't look cheerful. I hope all is well. All is not well, Akkalia. Did anyone die? No, nobody died, but um, something just happened. Yes. Ezemo came to my house this morning and delivered an unpleasant message concerning the coronation of a new Igwe. What did he say? Ezemo said that um, the occasion should be suspended indefinitely what does that mean i don't know i don't know i asked him the same question and he said even him did not know that uh, this was a message he got directly from the gods he went ahead to say if we doubted him we could go ahead and uh crown a new king and bear the consequences that follow. Oh no. Do you know the preparations I have put in for this occasion? 
Do you know the entire Eastern Region First Class Igwe's have been invited for this occasion? Do you know that the Southwest Obas have all been invited for this occasion? Do you know that all the emirs from the North have been invited for this occasion? And somebody wakes up to say it will be suspended indefinitely? No, you're joking. Akukale, I am not joking. I cannot joke with a matter as serious as uh, position of Igwe, of Omodi. I delivered a message as I got it from Ezemo, as he got it from the gods. If you still doubt this message, you can go ahead and crown yourself the king and bear the consequences that follow. I am only a messenger. I have to go now, Akalia. Akalia. God. Izogo, come to my house immediately. It is very urgent. Leave whatever you're doing. Come right away. suspecting Unowu's closeness to Ndoka in recent times. How do we know that Ezemo came to his house? Who else was there? The, uh, Ako, nobody's sure of anything. The problem is that these two men, Ndoka and Unowu, Faka and Haya, they had the problem with this community. Funny, it may be fair. I want you to go to Ezemo's house immediately to confirm this message. If it turns out to be false, 
I would personally strangle Onowu with my hands. Immediately I become the Igwe. He will be deposed. You become the Onowu. So start seeing yourself as Onowu. Who is not for me is against me and has to end up. Thank you, Ako. Uh, uh, but there's a small uh, problem. The ASMO does not divulge any information concerning the Igwe to anybody except the Ono, unless all the others go there as one. Uh, very simple. Move all the elders there as one. Move immediately. Mm. Mm. It's simple now. Mm. Five hundred thousand naira for logistics. We must see where this Uno Wu sabotage is coming from and nip it in the bud. Um, Igwe, I mean, your, your Majesty, Your Highness. In fact, consider it done. I will, I will, I will, I will, I will start immediately. Mm. Tell me, how do you hope to deal with stubborn ghosts like Ndoka and Okaf? Um, Your Majesty, leave leave that to me. I will, I will, I will, I will deal with them. Mm? Your Majesty, Igwe, Your Highness, um, Igwe, Your Highness. Mm. Don't worry, consider it done. Uncontrollable habit could lead you to unforeseen tragedy. But you don't want this is the time to make up for all my suffering. For him, Afunin and Natalia. Okay, no, there. Ah, game on. You there, Digo? Yes. Take this. This is a uh, 20,000. Oh, hold on, hold on. Mm -hmm. For soup, hmm? I told him soup, I want complete stock fish hmm? with uh, dried fish, mangala, and uh, goat meat. So I want to be perceiving the aroma of the soup. Now, my nyaka, I'm going to eat the Prepare the soup. I want to eat it today. Nay, are we celebrating something? Meaning what? So. If we are not celebrating something, I cannot enjoy myself in my house. My family will not eat well. Huh? Oh, poverty mentality. That is what is disturbing you. Obi Well, it was only when we got married to, uh, 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 many years ago that you gave me this kind of money to cook. Ah. Yes. Um, where is Ikechuku? Um, give him this money. He should get me uh, one carton of stout. I want this food to be ready by the time I come back so that when I'm eating, I'll use the stout to wash it down. Hmm? Hey. Mm. You know what? Uh -huh. What about my own? Your own? Hey. Mm. Anyway, I'm in a very good mood today. Oh. <laughs> hey. uh, I use this to buy something wow, for yourself. Wow, that is why I love you. Hey! Hey! hey. 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 Uh -uh. In short, for this hug. Uh -uh. Because I cannot remember the last time you hugged me like this. <laughs> If I did go, hey. use this to buy something nice for yourself. Hmm? You know what? Mm. So, hey, uh -huh. when you are dancing, when you are done dancing, go and prepare my food. Oh? Oh. Um, Mr. Man, what are you talking about? What nonsense? Huh. Oga, we need money. We need money to buy drinks. In fact, the company refused to supply us on credit anymore. Why? Uh, the period of grace has expired. What do you mean by the period of grace has expired? Can't you buy drinks with the money you make? Uh, Oga, there is no money here. Shishi! Platform is not with me. You are an idiot. You are nothing but a bunch of 
incompetency. How can I be bringing money from my pocket? Whereas I have a manager like you. Nya, 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 nya. You are more than idiots. Look at that you. I told you. You don't fuck up. Now where is all this money? Uh, uh, okay. you, you, you collected the whole money that was on me yesterday. In fact, I, you even told me that I should go and borrow from somebody so that you, I can give to you. But I told you that I don't see anybody that can lend me money. And since then you haven't made any more sales? People are no longer coming here the way they used to come before. Okay, look at our bar. Our bar is empty. Look at our show glass. Our show glass. The turkey. The amandula. But what the what? All the pepper soup. None of them is there. Every time you be telling me, I should give uh, this girl. Any girl that half breast, that I should give them anything in your name. That you are capable. Now, Dorima is not for service. Mm. Dorima is not for civil servant. That is what you have been saying. Okay, go go to Squad Monaka. It's not my fault now. Huh? Hi. Jesus. You are not a useless manager. Is this? You are, you, are, you are nothing but an empty manager. Hey. Give me a company of skills. Idiots. You are here by sacked. Huh? Now, do you know this person out of this town? Hey, man, no, come, please now, please. Mind you, like that. I don't want to see you anywhere around this town. And if I do, I will make sure I deal with you. And my friends will deal with you too. Hey, go ahead, go ahead. Hey, 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 hey. The flexing money is what you just wasted out of your stupidity. And hey, 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 Thief! I told you. I told you. Thief! I told you. I told you. Thief! 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 Thief! I told you. Thief! I told you. Thief! I told you. Thief! I told you. Thief! I told don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Don't worry. We are going to deal with you, don't worry. It has not finished, don't worry. Listen, we are going to recover. Recover what? I'm telling you, I am going to do some investigation to make sure that we recover from this stupid manager. Recover what? What are you recovering? Don't worry. Me are you chopper? Me are you, me are you the, with the, the guy that they do the rime? The rime? Inside the amino? Now the body is gone. What are we going to do? Yeah, what don't cast? Hey! <laughs> Frank, you want to move? Don't even know me for civil servants. See, if you know be Yahoo, you know be Yahoo boy. You go follow Yahoo boy. Smell like Yahoo. Why then you go go broke? And if you go broke, you go listen, go borrowing. Listen, this is not the end of the world for us. Calm down. When you can't go, I don't want to go to the man. I go. I want to the money. Can I go see ya? Only me last time by a passing by a day. More fife, batola, batola. All biams allow them and with them. And and they all these girls now. We are not going to meet them anymore. Kine kudo kuge se. Hey, go to the man. I ne ko kuge se. Udi mugu. Frankie udi udi u udi u. No, you are not the man. You call this for another brother. Another brother. You are supposed to be advising me. Calm down. Frankie will not mugu. He will he will do it. He will he will do why are you not supposed to be advising me? If I say bring the rima, you say brother, calm down, calm down. Na sefo savanti, na ende go the rima de mo fife. Okay, 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 but wait. I should be advising you. So he was so maka. Ma na advise him when he ni mo le fe de mama. Mo e fu that girl. You was telling me that ni fo bu no be able come and care aso. Bato, bato. Yawa don gas. We say yawa don gas. Calm down. What is it? I'm sick. Calm down. 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 Hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. I'm all. I'm also, I'm also satisfied. Mm. Rice is good. Uh, um. So um. Zero. 
Mm-hmm. Ako. Ako Kalia. Mm. Give me 100,000 naira to share among the elders for what I just told you. Uh, but I reasoned that if I do as he says, I took a siega. It will not be meaningful. Eh? We will be going home with peanuts. So, I thought of something. Hmm? So, I decided to split it into half. This is 50,000 naira, your own share. Only me. Only you. Yes. I has this money. Yes. I'm the one that have this money. Mm. He gave it to me. Mm. Fifty thousand. Equal partnership. You take fifty, I take fifty. Mm. Mm. Yes. So if you agree to what I've said, uh, there's no need to go for any consultation. We go and tell Ako. This is the situation. Once you agree, we will not have any problem. <laughs> Whatever you told me to do, I will do it. Eh? If it's him, eh? and then eh? who am I? <laughs> I've already agreed before you ask me. <laughs> <laughs> if I did go. Hey! I'm going to be a good guy. Mm. If you want more drink, it, if, even if you want a more stock fish, my wife will bring. No, 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 I'm satisfied. I'm okay. Ah. I brought these things for you and I. Zero. <laughs> 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 okay. Uh, yes. Between the both of you, who is Ifama and Anna here? Hi, I'm Ifama. All right, we are the 30s from police headquarters. Okay. Your name appeared in the recent bank fraud we have. You have to follow us to the station and get yourself cleared. Fraud? How? How? I don't understand. When you get to the station, you clear yourself. I don't. Station. Oh, officer, please, my friend cannot be involved in of such a loss. Are you a co conspirator? Or what? No, no. So, why are you defending her? Sir, please, can, can I at least call my manager? We don't have time for all this. When you get there, you can call whoever you want to call. Miss Ifoma Ibeneme, do you remember me? Yes, Mr. Tigana. Yes, I deposited some money in your microfinance bank some time ago. I know, sir, but. I didn't tamper with your account. Why am I being arrested? We'll find out when you get to the station. If you clear yourself, you can leave. Let's go. Move it.
take a drink. Sir, I don't want to drink. Sir, please. I just want to clear my name first. I'm a foundation staff of the bank, and I've never been found one thing. Sir, please, can I have the document so I can clear my names? Please, sir, please. You'll get the documents, for sure. But first, I'd like to ask you a few questions. Apart from the day we met in your bank when I came to deposit money, do you remember any other encounter with me? Yes, sir. I, I remember your mom's burial. A lot of people were spraying plenty money. People even came with a lot of cows. That's not what I'm talking about. Personal encounter, I mean. No, sir. I can't remember anything. Really? Fraud in the bank. Hey! Why are you screaming? Fraud! I knew it. I knew that if Fomai was always low poison, I was pretending to be self-righteous, but then she is the devil! I knew it! Hey! Wait, wait, wait. If Fomai has nothing to do with this. She wasn't even the one that was accused. But why was she arrested? Kelechi, why was your friend being arrested? Huh? It was a false accusation. It was a false accusation. Hey. What kind of false accusation? Eh? That young, tall, sexy, nice man I saw will never accuse anybody falsely. Really? Yes. She committed an offense. And she's been arrested. I pray she should go to jail. Yes. A shagara in this village is too much. Always carrying her shoulder up. Behaving as if she's the first person that works in the bank. Cynthia, microfinance bank at that. What is your problem with Ifoma? Why are you always bitter about her? She what is too arrogant and self-righteous. Holier than thou, but with a wicked heart. No wonder. Odinake her abandoned her and marry pretty Adora. <laughs> and you have been her friend all along. And you're even mocking her with something that happened to her. So you're happy about it. Aww. Huh, Sai. What could I have done? I was just managing her as my friend. You know, I was thinking that she would change. But no, she goes worse by the day. And now, <laughs> Yama has cut her with that. I don't agree with you. If Oma cannot do that, if Oma didn't do it, why would you agree with me? Huh? When you're busy enjoying the money she stole from the bank. I won't take that from you. I will not have you say rubbish about me. Did you hear me? What's even wrong with you? Slow down, my friend. Slow down. You know, the truth is always bitter. Very bitter. <laughs> but let me tell you something. Just a piece of advice, my friend. Be careful before they come and handcuff you too. Hmm? What is even wrong with this girl? Well, I don't blame you. I blame you for for mother made you a, a friend. Rubbish. The day I came to your bank to deposit money, and I saw you. I kept saying that I know this person, you know. I I couldn't I couldn't recollect, you know, where we met before, but I don't know. <laughs> I got back home, it kept on disturbing me until two days ago. I think I remembered clearly. And I started looking for you. I don't understand. Where was that? Many years ago, then I was still serving my master, I was traveling to Lagos and I don't know what happened to me. I lost my money. I, I think I was robbed or something, you know, 
these pickpockets guys it took my money my, my wallet and my phone i was stranded i was crying i tried to explain to the driver and the passengers there but nobody believed me but a young lady paid for me you remember Yes, I, I remember. That was um, 10 years ago. Exactly. I was going to purchase my jam form in Lagos. Yes. I remember, I remember. The, the, the people there, nobody believed me. They, they, they thought I was a fraudster. Mm -hmm. But you volunteered to pay my transport fee. Yes. Yes. This voice. <laughs> I remember. <laughs> Small word small world. then you, <laughs> you were a teenager and i remember you told me you were from this village Umundi. yeah but i don't understand emeka tigana is that really you well to the glory of the almighty god it's me good to see you again i when i came to your bank i saw you i said i knew this person kept on disturbing me. I said, I know, I know this lady. I, I just couldn't remember where I, where I met you. And then finally I recollected and here we are. I had not know what to say. Girls, you girls miss. You should have been there to see what I saw with my two eyes. Police, police came in that they big van. If you see the way they were coming down, they cocked their gun and they were shooting. Wah, 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 wah. You needed to see the way they dragged Ifoma. Your Ifoma. They dragged her. You needed to see the way they kicked her. What did she do now? She is a criminal! They say she and her gang robbed bank and stole so much millions. See, they are taking her to Abuja and they say she's not coming back. She will be in jail. Everlasting to everlasting. She's not coming back. They, they, if you see the way they, oh my, it's so disappointing, so disgraceful. You needed to be there. The, the way they were beating her, she started calling names. She was mentioning people one after the other. She was, eh? hey, hey. It's so disgraceful. I can't even say it. I can't even hide my face because oh, people know I was a friend. Oh, I was close to her. No, I disagree with you. I don't believe that Tifuma can do such a thing. Shut up! Who told you that? Hey, that's no water off us. She is so poisoned. I told you. You needed to see the way they drag her on the floor. Like you girls were not there. You were not there to see what happened to our wife for Mao. Hey! hey! I wish I'm there. I like seeing this kind of thing. I wish I'd been there to see it. You see the way they, 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 they kick her. She was crying. She was even confessing that it's not only her, that there are plenty. Oh. She, she begins to call them. She was calling. Hey, you needed to see something. First of all, Let me apologize to you for coming to you the way I did. With the police and, you know, it looked as if I came to arrest you. The whole bank thing, uh, documents accusing you of fraud, it's all a prank. Believe me, you know what a prank is, right? Yes, it's all a prank. I came up with that so I can bring you to my house. I'm sorry. Oh my God, but really that was an expensive prank. Someone would have died or something. You're right, and I apologize. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. It's okay. <laughs> but I, I noticed something. All through, you were not rattled by the situation. I was actually, but when I saw you, I became more relaxed because I know you wouldn't hurt an innocent person. Really? Yeah. How did you know? People say you're kind and generous. Oh. <laughs> now I'm blushing. <laughs> okay, so at least we've established that I cannot hurt you. Take your drink while we talk. Thank you. So, why do you bring me here? to propose to you. I don't understand. Oh, 
You're joking, right? You're mad. You're joking, right? You're a wonderful person. A very wonderful lady. And you deserve the best. Please marry me. Yes. I will marry you. It's just like a dream. Oh, God. Thank you. Thank you. I missed you too, girl. <laughs> what happened? I've been trying to reach you, but your line has not been connecting. I know you've been trying to reach me, but he seized my phone. In fact, he threw away my phone. <laughs> Who seized your phone and why? He got me this, girl. An iPhone. Who, who got you an iPhone? <laughs> and he I proposed. Damn ring, baby girl. Damn ring! <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> who got you this ring? <laughs> I'm supposed to you. Emeka Tigana. Yeah, wait. Sit, sit, let me just Emeka Tigana. You remember the incident that took place? Those men that came to the house yesterday were not Paris men. They were actually sent by Emeka Tigana to, for them to bring me to his house. Wait, you mean those boys that came here actually took you to Emeka's house? He took me to his house. He proposed to me there. He do. <laughs> Emeka. Tigana, of course, proposed to you. Yes, girl, he did. How? <laughs> Wait, Ify, stop laughing now. Wait, have you met this guy before? It's actually a story for another day. It's a long story. I will tell you. But for now, check this out, girl. Check it out. What All for you. Bag? Open it. Don't joke. Do Open it, girl. Open it. Are you serious? She got me all that, and I said, let me give my friend some. Wait. Open the box. Open it. I want you acting up. You see, uh -huh. you got all these things for me. Yes, baby. All this for me. Yes, baby. He actually took me out for shopping and got the whole word for me. And I said, let me give my girlfriend some. Oh, this is so <laughs> fine. Oh. Wait. If you got all this for me. Of course. I have three bosses inside. Don't worry. You can take everything. Take the bus. Take everything. I should take even the bus. Of course. <laughs> Chai, thank you so much. Thank you. You're my good friend. Oh. <laughs> He's taking me to Lagos on Saturday to see his friends and family members. <laughs> all these things are happening so fast. My dear, I can hardly breathe, but I love the feeling. I'm happy for you, girl. <laughs> thank Congrats. You. I'm happy for you. Then again, he is coming to pay my bride price. Yes. He said he wants to do a small trad, then an international wedding. <laughs> Which one is international wedding? <laughs> My is that one? <laughs> if you ask me, who will I ask? <laughs> the good thing is that you're, you're getting married. I am happy for you. I, I, I know. My kid is there. Come, <laughs> come let me show you the things he actually got for me. I know you like her, but come, please let me pack my things. I can keep it aside. Just no, come. No, I'm carrying it inside. No, chop it. Chop me. Let's go in here. No, let's go inside. Let me go and see. Nchamel, bad news. We are coming from uh, Ezemo's place, and we've confirmed that it was Ezemo that told Ono that your coronation has to be suspended uh, for now. Uh, so uh, I tried to find out why it was uh, suspended, uh, but Ezemo said that the gods have not uh, uh, told him anything. Uh, uh, the thing is that uh, uh, I didn't, I couldn't push further. I even went there with uh, two native files and yes. uh, two bags of yours. Yeah. Two, uh, two bags of yours, yes. Uh, all the others went except for Ndoka. Um, Ndoka, Ndo 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 yes. They are the only ones that did not go with us. Uh, so um, 
uh, even the money you gave us was not enough but i mm. i we had to rally around to make sure that we got what you wanted uh, uh, that is the bad news uh, we tried our best because we you know that if other if you profit you it will profit yes. both of us um ichia ichia kokai yes 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 you don't need to be bothered eh this is just a temporary setback okay and within a very short time very soon everything will be fine yes it has been confirmed in the spirit and in the physical yes it's done bam it's done it's a video what is going on? How? Eh? Is it not you that told me that Ifoma was arrested? Eh? Mm -hmm. Is she not supposed to be in prison? Why are we now hearing that she's getting married to Tsigana? What's happening? Is she not supposed to be in prison? How can Tsigana, Tsigana of all people, marry someone that stole from him? What, 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 as a, what kind of story is this? She used Juju. I hope you don't suffocate with jealousy against the former. I never told you such. What kind of nonsense is that? Eh? What is this one you are telling me now? I never told you anything like that, Cynthia. You were the one that twisted the whole story to suit your hatred for her. And even went as far as telling people that she and her and robbery gang went to the bank and stole. Eh -eh! How dare you? Isn't that what you told me that I told her that? Eh? Huh? Isn't that what you told me that I have to tell her that? Am I the only one that's supposed to hear it? I huh? never told you any such! You witch! It's your father. It's your family that is a witch. Kelechi is your family that is a witch. Ah! Huh? Look at this girl. Why are you denying something that you told me? Is it because it's, it's backfired? Why are you denying it? I never knew you're this evil, Cynthia. I never told you such. What is wrong with you? Kelechi, it is your word against mine. Look at you. You want to use me and shine in this village. It will not work. Hmm. Look at this one. Brat like you. Really? <laughs> you have not seen the last of me. Then let's watch her. Look at this stupid guy. Is something wrong with you? Get... Come, come, come. Get that. What is that what you told me? You. Are you mad? You. 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 This is what you will see. This girl is not look normal. At, look, at, look, at, look at this idiot. You want to go and lie? Before they know to tell people that you said it because I am bold. I am telling the word that I said it. Why are you denying your own? Why are you denying your own? Don't ask me, are you? See, I'll kill this girl. Why, why are you denying your own? Look at you. Look at this joint. Lay, lay like you. You've not seen the last of me yet. You've not seen it. I swear you've not seen the last of me yet. I never knew your mother said I told you. I told you I'll get you. You are talking when I'm talking. Are you serious? Huh? You, you, you're talking nonsense. Come, I'll catch you. Look at this idiot. You're talking nonsense. You don't know what you said. You don't know what you said. Eh? Yes, I am Cynthia. I am bold enough to tell you that I said it. Be bold to tell you that you said it. Look at all these pretenders. This small what I offer. You will see. Ah, what kind of nonsense is that? You lied. You lied against me. Ah, look at this idiot. You lied. You will see. Look at you. You will see. Thank you. 
Hello, Cynthia. Hello, the luckiest girl in town. Ify, my bestie. The billionaire's wife. The only girl that scattered Tigana's head. Ne, congratulations, my friend. Thank you very much. All those praises for me. Yes, you deserve it, my friend. Oh, you don't know the news is everywhere. You are Tigana's wife to be. God's favor is upon you. And you know what, my friend? I am so happy for you. <laughs> I am so happy. Like I'm overwhelmed with joy. Thank you very much, Cynthia. Thank you. Uh, please, you know you're my friend. I want you to be very careful with the people you call your friends. Has changed now, things are stoned the other side. Heavy and jealousy will be the order of the day. Bikunu, eh? Okay, but is there any problem? She you know I don't have many friends, just few. Hmm, even with that, the few ones still be very careful. Eh? Cynthia, is there any problem? <laughs> no, <laughs> no problem, just that. <laughs> you can imagine that your friend. Your so-called best friend, Kelechi. She was busy spreading the news that you committed fraud in the bank. And then police came and arrested you that <laughs> you will be in prison in the next 20 years. Oh, my dear friend, you needed to see me. I was weeping. I was crying. I was like, that Ify cannot do it. Ify is my best friend. I know Ify too well. She cannot do something like that. Before someone else come and tell me, no. That is a lie, yo. That Tikana sent his escort to come and pick you to his palace as a VIP and then propose to you with a diamond ring. <laughs> ne, I am happy for you. My friend, my friend. <laughs> wow. Kele, she said all that. <laughs> Live and direct. That's why I'm telling you to be careful. <laughs> Thank you very much for your love and care. I really appreciate <laughs> Um, Ne. And one of these days, I am going to come to your house. And please, when Oga comes, tell him more so that he will get ready for me on time. Hmm? I will. Thank you. <laughs> I trust you, my friend. And you know, um, one millionaire has a gift. It's not a bad idea. Hey, you know he has been doing for, he has done so much for that people. I'm your best friend now. If you know me, I'm your best friend. Cynthia will deliver your message. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. And you know I love you. <laughs> Thank you. And take care of Ugao. Uh -huh. I know you will. <laughs> okay. Take care of yourself. <laughs> okay. Take care. Bye-bye. Mm. Bye, Cynthia. Take care. Um, we all know why we are gathered here. Ezemo has lifted the ban on the Igwe contest for our community. That is why I summoned this meeting so that uh, we can collectively nominate, adopt, and confirm a candidate to be the Igwe of Umudim community. Okay, for them. They won. The floor is open. What do you make a name on? 
The floor is open for contributions. Um, oh no, you have spoken well. Do you check and I am on. Um, there is no point in looking for a candidate because we already have one. We have a candidate standing by. A candidate that has given so much. A candidate that has done so much for this community. Hmm? We are talking about Chief Akokalia. Akokalia Nemelora. Hmm? As a matter of fact, it will be an abomination to even consider comparing Akokalia with someone else. What we should be talking about is to fix a new date. So that Akokalia will print fresh invitation cards and give to his friends. Uh, he has already wasted money on the other invitation cards and beer boards and all the things he has done. But it is so nothing. Oh, believe it, Kabo. Let us fix a date. If a baby. Izuago, one name, my good brother. You have spoken well. Uh, let, for me, let us set a new date for the coronation of Akokalia as the Igwe of Umudim. Not so fast, though. Akukalia is not the only one qualified to be Igwe. Uh -huh. And who else, if not Akukalia? Anytime, any day. Look at you. Look at what you're talking about. That boy in America. What does he know? We are talking about the culture and tradition of our people. Yes. We are talking about Igwe, the custodian of our people. In Ekuoku, in America, Ibi Igwe abohe Igwe club and Eba Krikata. Eh? Talk some sense. That boy in America has done more for our community. Than your so called candidate Akukalia, who came back from the city to exploit us. Taking over people's land, using police and army to intimidate our people. Mm -hmm. Nameka has revived our community hospital, our community school, and he is presently building a modern town hall and community center for us. Mm -hmm. Nameka has placed 50 of our brightest children on scholarship. And he has taken additional 10 to Lagos to train them in their business. Mm -hmm. What exactly has Akalia done for us? Apart from bribing some of our gullible minded elders to cause confusion mm -hmm. and to what our collective will. Yes. We are talking about we are talking about tradition, not philanthropy. What has he done? No, 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 this is not a shouting uh, match. We are here for serious business. Um, it will be a matter of choice. It's about decision. It is not about um, fighting or shouting. Please, let this not repeat. Is there anybody else who has an opinion on this matter? My fellow elders, we should all know that this is not a market women meeting, but meeting of honored people, honorable people. Let us compose and be what we are. Uh, yes, tradition and uh, uh, custom Eh? They're all good. We have been in it. I lived and I grew up still in it, but with nothing to show. But I want to let you know that this world is moving faster than we expected. Of which, if you don't meet up with it, you'll be dropped out. 
<laughs> Yesterday, it was analog. And today, what is it? Digital. If I may suggest, we need a very vibrant young man that can stand. If you call him in the night, he will come up. If it has to do with going to overseas, he will go for us. If he needs to see the president, he will go there to bring what belongs to us. And there is only one person I see that quality. And that is Nemeka. Stop campaigning! Stop campaigning! Stop campaigning! Stop campaigning! Stop campaigning! Um, well, in the absence of um, any other contribution or opinion on this matter, I want to make my position known. For so long, we have been trying to make Akukalia the Igwe of Umudim. Uh, but it did not work. It did not work, and it still has not worked. Within the period of suspension of this process, another candidate emerged. In the person of Nemeka. It appears the gods have a hand in this matter. If you ask me. So, what it means is that uh, as it stands, we have two candidates contesting for this position. On one hand, Chief Gabriel Akukalia. On the other hand, Nemeka Madoka. I do not want to be partial. Neither do I want to be partisan by virtue of my position. We are in a democracy now, are we not? Yes. Majority carries the vote. On the strength of that, I want to put this matter to vote. Are we agreed on it? Uh, let us vote. If you know that you want Chief Akokalia to become the next Igwe of Omudim, Obododike, indicate by raising up your hand. I don't know what I got go. Um, as we can see, it is um, only two of us, Ichie Izo and Ichie Zerowa, who have voted for Akokalea. It is noted. Now, those of us who want Nemeka Madoka to become the next Igwe of our land, Umudim, Obododike, please indicate by raising up your hand. The moving train! Um, and I want to join my votes. Yes. To oh, oh. Yes. <laughs> I can't be named. Oboro. That means seven of us yes. against yes. two of us. If you don't know Kuruku, by this vote, right. by this vote, it means that Nietzsche, the kingmakers of Omodi, have unanimously voted and decided that Nemeka Madoka shall be the next Igwe of Umodim. And so shall it be. Isse! Isse! Umodim! Makan! Yeah! Umodim! Makan! Yeah! Umodim! Mwanu! Yeah! Umodim! Zwanu! Yeah! Umodim! Kachano! Yeah! Umodim! Umodim! Neonu! Isse! Look at that. 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 Look at that.
Au nom où il va être des bons noms. Tiens de cas. Tiens de cas. Au nom où il va être des bons noms. Mettons le tout le monde. Mettons le tout le monde. Il va être. Ils ont vu notre soin. Ils ont. 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 Ils And you can argue, oh, come in. Holding up Bambana, you're holding up Bambana, you're holding up Bambana, you're Nameco Dogu, Nameco Dogu, Ebene, and the Bolivu, Ebene, and the Bolivu, or Kangamu, the Kano, Ome, is that the Kan? Oh, yeah, is that? Oh, yeah, is that the Kan? Is that the Kan? Is that the Kan? Is that the Kan? So, this is what this is all about. All the schemings and machinations was geared towards depriving me of my God-given position. Now, never, Onyebo Tigana, a charlatan, a Yahoo boy, a ritualist, to become my own Igwe. All you Ichies are nothing but a bunch of hungry dogs scavenging for food. I will fight this battle all by myself and still become the Igwe. Um, <clears throat> Ako, it is not our fault. Mm -hmm. yeah? That's that boy. He bribed them. He, he gave them big money. Also, ego. He used money to confuse them. Mm. Uh, that's the problem. Uh, um, but if you can uh, bring some money, even if it is half of half of what you he gave them, uh, we will try to con convince them to change their mind. It's all gone. You put that in again. I can't give it. Get out of my house. All of you are the same. And as for you, Tigana, whatever they call you, I will deal with you. You will not know what hit you. By the time I'm through with you, you'll be better dead. Zog Eliam. Zog Eliam. Take it easy To be a king is not a I really need to talk to a maker on my behalf You know you're the only one that can talk to him I know I messed up, yes But I love him so much And I can't lose him I've realized my mistakes Please just, just tell him to just talk to me, please Well, there's no need for that now, alright? He has moved on, so I advise you move on too. Move on? I can't move on without him. He is the love of my life. I love him so much. Please just help me talk to him. I see. The very one you love is married now. Married? Mm -hmm. He has even paid um, the bride price. So what we are waiting for is his um, coronation that is coming soon as the equal of his community. Igwe, uh -huh. Emeka, uh -huh. Igwe. I should have been the Lolo. I thought you said you don't like uh, local things. I didn't used to, but I do now. Uh -huh. I see. So you're trying to tell me that there's nothing that you can do about it? There is nothing I will do about it. It's always good for you to know what you want no. and go for it. There's something that can be done. I'm sure, I'm sure when Emeka sees me, when, when he sees me, he will fall in love with me again, right? I'm sure, just, just help me, please. Okay, wait for him then. Good. Duncan!
they really enjoy me. Look at your house. <laughs> your gown is nice. Mm. Thank you very much, my friend. Thank you. <laughs> well, we are rooting for you now very soon. We'll join you. <laughs> of course, I wish you luck. <laughs> I've been meaning to discuss something with you. What is it? Is there a problem? No, not at all. Do you know that Cynthia is not your friend? Ever since you got married to Emeka Tigana, she has been saying a whole lot of rubbish about you. In fact, she's just taking things out of proportion. Just like the other day that uh, police people came to your house to arrest you. Do you know this girl went about telling people in the village that you were caught with your armed robbery gang? And that was why they arrested you. I mean, she's just acting like your enemy. I really don't understand that girl. Then after when the uh, Yameka finally engaged you, she then came with another story you, that she used Juju to pin him down. Can you imagine that nonsense? Me, yeah, I decided not to talk oh, because I, I wouldn't want to, you know, spoil your relationship with her because I don't know when you started. But I, I just said I should at least try and let you know because that kind of energy is not needed. I don't understand. Kelechi, I believe you 100%. You do? Yes. I know Cynthia better than you do. She even called me to report you to me. That I did what? <laughs> she said, um, actually, she turned everything that she said around, that you said you go about telling people that I'm a froster. Ah, yeah. Cynthia. <laughs> but I know better, my friend. I know better. <laughs> you know, Cynthia has never been a good friend. Yeah. Honestly. She sees me as a rival. Honestly, I didn't want to disclose all that to you because I wanted you to sit and know the right thing and tackle yourself and know the opinions to take and all that. You're really a nice person, Ify. I know. <laughs> I don't understand. Please leave Cynthia alone. Cynthia is in the house. That's a good act. I enjoy myself, darling. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, how are you? All right, I'll be back shortly. I want to go see the local government chairman so we can discuss fixing the major road that leads to our village. Okay. Take care of yourself, okay? You too. Don't miss me too much. I won't. <laughs> Kelechi. Yes, sir. This is for you. All this for me? Yes, my wife told me uh, a lot of good things about you. Thank you deserve you. it. Thank you, sir. God bless you. Yes. Thank you. Thank and you're a nice man, too. Thanks, honey. <laughs> Thank you. Take care of yourself. You too. <laughs> if you thank you so much, what would I have done without you? Nothing. Imagine 100k, all for me. You mm. deserve more, girl. Thank and thank you for being a good friend. Always. Always. <laughs> Thanks. I appreciate But you're looking good here. See you. <laughs> me, you. That is eating money now. Me, that is just I taking. Know. I know. I know. Hey, Kelechi. Thank you. Thank you. Mm. You'll not forget your money. Forget <laughs> what? 100k. Hmm. At least you just can spare me on my day. <laughs> then, uh, not two of us. I will spare you in a small thing. My husband said our wedding will be the wedding of the millennium. Yes, yeah, so. And the title will be Igwe Wets Ife. Oh! And even the vice president will be in attendance. Wow. <laughs> Congratulations. My girl is taking. Oh, I'm my happy for you. Taking. I know, right? I know. See, every disappointment is a blessing. I keep telling you this, my dear. You know, I didn't know that God was actually preparing a better place for me. I swear. And I'm so happy. <laughs> Do you remember when I was telling you about Odinaka? You were crying over him. I told you that God was preparing something very special for you. And now it has come to reality. I know, right? <laughs> Israel. You know what? My problem is that people come in tens and twenties just to ask for assistance. And you know I have to attend to them and all. I know. <laughs> and I know you're equal to the task. Of course. Um, God really prepared you for this. I and know. I know you can handle it. Of course. So I just can. take your time and it's not really a big deal. Come, let me see. <laughs> Thank you. I really am. You are really adding. Oh. Hey, God, don't tell me that <laughs> for my which adding. <laughs> Hey, hey, I was a surprise, but I thought you would call to say you're coming. Please, please sit down. Chief Akukalia, I saw it. Onyego. Onyego. 
Please, what, what can I offer you, sir? Um, no, thank you. I haven't got time for such uh, frivolities now. I came to give uh, a very important message to you. First, I want you to consider it a great privilege that Akokalia Rapu be aware be abege. And um, never said that. I, you see, these useless elders who are pushing you to be the Igwe, they don't mean well for you. They want to destroy you. I will advise you to step down for me. Support me with your contacts, your wealth, to become the Igwe instead of challenging me. Mm. Mm. <coughs> um, Chief, I'm not challenging you. I'm only obeying a divine mandate to serve our people. So you want to go ahead? Yes, I will go ahead. Not because I want to hurt you. Far from it. The people want me. The elders want me. So I'll serve them. <laughs> Let me make it clear to you. It's only the living that can become the Igwe. Chief. Are you threatening me, Chief? I'm not a gentleman. I don't play fair. I have made many people disappear. Don't be counted in that number. All right. I see. Now I understand why even the gods have rejected you as well. Same way the people rejected you. Nobody wants you. You don't have leadership qualities. You have no business being king. What you're doing now is obsolete. Old tactics. Nobody does this anymore. Can get you into trouble. Look around you. I have gadgets here that just recorded everything you said. If I send it to the police, Chief, you'll go to jail. Believe me, if you doubt it, I can play it back for you right now. I'll advise you, Chief, don't do this again. Do not try it. I'm not a child. I did not get to this level by being stupid. I'm a very smart young man and I'm very rich. Very, very rich. I'm equal to the task. It means we'll go, Chief. It's we go. Do not try this again. Aquado Morfuma. Don't. small boy like the gun outsmart you. How could I have fallen into such a trap? Now, I can't do anything indirectly. Otherwise, that devilish gadget will be used against me. Hello, son. Listen, Nambe. I don't have money. Look, this Igwe thing is costing me a lot of money. I mean, are you not ashamed? People send money from abroad to their parents. Here we are sending you money. If you're not there, Maggie. 
a young man like you, 28 years, and you, you just ask for money as we will pluck it from one tree. I am here working for this ego thing because when I get in, I'm going to make it hereditary so that you can become the next ego. So I'm in, indirectly working for you. And here you are. Join other boys. Take a part-time job. Pay your school fees. Do things. Don't have enough for this kind of nonsense again. Give me a Darling. Believe me, I do not like the way you just spoke to our son now. Like I how? don't like it. Like how? You should be encouraging this boy instead of making him feel hopeless, worthless, and useless. Ugo Mahdi, the worthless, hopeless, and useless. I should be speaking to a 28 year old boy like a motivational speaker. After spending millions of naira, spending for his first degree, he studied a four year course in six years. I should be talking to him nicely, eh? And so. And so, all fingers are not equal. That is your own dictionary. You cost all this. I wanted my son to study here so that he can also understand my business so that he can take over. You wanted him abroad because your friend's children are abroad. Unnecessary, unhealthy, unrivaled competition. Look at what it has cost us. Honey, please. Honey, I don't know what you're talking about. All I'm trying to tell you is please look for money and give to this boy for his master's program. That's all. Ugo, ma. Send him your own money. Each year go. Which money? Which money I ask? When was the last time you gave me money in this house? Dick Eddie Banaga. Go say now. Say the only thing that matters to you right now is just your contest about this Igwe. That's all. I don't have time for your petty statements. You are just like your son. Hmm? Look at it. I'm trying to get money. I place that my land at Amateur. Ten plus of it for sale. So I can be able to undo this boy and here you are talking no, no, nonsense just hear yourself Negodu Ochiara hear yourself just imagine what you said you want to sell land to match a little boy Odaba I lent your father 2 million naira he's not been able to take my call so I made my call avoid you should see me every day and start clapping I built a house for your family if not, who no akareka kono be? I hear you are talking nonsense. When I talk, you talk. You feel like they make No problem. No problem. Why don't you go to CNN and announce it? What you have been doing for me, your wife, and my family? Go and announce it. That's it. Oh. What have you ever done for anybody without using it against that person? I have gone to BBC already. If you don't know. Mm, yes. Girl, what? You should look. Let me tell you. Mm. You should be happy. I pulled your family. Out of poverty. You should see me and start saying you over bless this man for me. Here you are talking about money. Give me some accolades, woman. I'll be humble. I don't blame you. Look at a boy who is now a full grown man who should take responsibility. Can't even pass one exam. A a like trail and a push Volkswagen, first degree. Now on a man size degree, I can't even pull it like that. What is it? Please let's go. 
Cynthia, I can't go out with you. As you can see, I'm washing. And after this, I have something else to do for my mother. Wait, so if you don't do all this for your mother, what will happen? She won't take it lightly with me. Eh, hey, but at least she will not kill you now. Uh huh. See, Ozima, please. You have to stop this your good girl character. You know, these days, good people suffer more than bad people. Are you not saying I should become a bad girl? No. How can I say that? What I'm telling you is that please loosen up yourself a little from this bondage. You are in bondage. Loosen up yourself. Ah! How? <laughs> I'll tell you. Now that your parents are not around, you are telling me I'm doing something for my parents. They asked me to wash clothes and I have other things to do. My dear, that is bondage. Yes, that is bondage. My friend, loosen up yourself a little. Let us go out and enjoy ourselves. When it is time for your parents to come back, you rush back home and finish up what they ask you to do. In that way, they will not understand. And that will make you a perfect smart girl in this village. Enjoy myself when I don't even have money to buy anything. What are you saying? Do I not look like money? I am money myself. Eh? Cynthia has money. Ozioma, come let us go out. Eh? You know you are very beautiful. Let's go out. I'll buy you something. I'll just buy you alcohol. Something that will make you happy. Anything you want. But I don't take alcohol. Okay, don't worry about alcohol. I'll buy you chicken. Eh? Just, you know one thing about me, Ozioma. I don't want to go out there alone. If I'm going out alone, all these village, village rats. You see all these boys, they will just be running after me as if I'm the only Cynthia in this village. And I don't like that. I just want you to accompany me. Eh? You know, I'm like your big sister. Let me show you the way. You know you're my friend now. I'm like your big sis. Let's go. Come on. Take this thing. Let's just go. Nee, let's go. I don't like your face. So. Come on. Don't worry. Whatever you want to give to you. Okay. I will go with you. But promise me. We won't stay long. Then. Ah, but are we going to sleep on the road? Eh? We won't sleep on the road. Let's just go. Because me, I don't want my mommy to shout at me. Ah, uh, no. If she shout at you, just come and slap me. Let's just go. Once you get tired, just tell me. Whisper to my ear. I'll bring you back home. Nothing will happen to you, please. Huh? Let's just go. Let's go. Yeah? Hey, let me. Don't worry. Let me carry the two let for you. Let's go. And don't wash yourself. To the car, they wanted to grab me. I ran as fast as my leg could carry me, oh. <laughs> and there's some more with my friend. <laughs> oh, we pass in our town. Oh, Abomination, like... how we may. Eh? Oh. So, so, who is bringing this evil into this uh, peaceful community? Who is that person? Uh, uh, huh? My daughter, calm down. Oh? <laughs> calm down, you'll be fine. Just talk to us. Were you able to recognize any of them? Yes. Were you? Yes. <laughs> they were all marked. <laughs> but I managed to 
<laughs> to recognize one of them <laughs> because of the way he was and <laughs> because of his voice. <laughs> Because some time ago he was toasting me. Who is that? Who is that? Talk. Who is he? I don't want to get into trouble. Tell, tell us. Tell us. Who is he? You are safe. Talk. I don't know his name. But he's one of those boys that used to come with Oga Tigana from the city. What? Tigana's talk? <laughs> Who? Oh, so it is Tigana that sent kidnappers to kidnap a daughter of Umudim for money ritual. Oh, we said it. I and Izua, we told you errors. Eh? That uh, uh, the money is not genuine. It's ritual money. Now you, you have seen it, you have heard with your ear. I've been saying it. Ritual on our room, karma, ritual money. So his money is ritual. Huh? Let us go and tell the elders. Elders must hear it. They must hear it. They what? must hear what? Uh, uh, we told yeah. you. I need to walk to you. Do you believe I did it? Do you believe I'm a ritualist? That I'm a kidnapper? Do you? No. Never. If I did, I wouldn't be here. Thank you. So who do you think is behind this? Who is? If not Akokalia, or maybe some other criminals. But Akokalia and his acolytes want to pin it on you. The witness said she saw one of my boys there. How do we explain that? That is where I am confused. I tried to talk to that girl since yesterday. But she's always in Akokalia's house. Or with Izogo and Zeroa. Hmm. Something is going on. Something fishy is going on. Definitely. Those vultures are up to something. I will get to the root of it. I will get to the root of it. <sighs> I'll be traveling tomorrow morning. First thing tomorrow. No. Tomorrow morning. No. Not now. They will think you are running away. I have to go, it's urgent. You have nothing to worry about, Al. <clears throat> I'll be following up the case from there. And like I told you, I'll get to the root of it. Right? Just be strong for me. Please. Be very strong. Thank you so much for believing me. I'm innocent. And I know that with time, I will be vindicated. Okay, I'll be leaving now. All right, sir. but be careful. Please, be careful. I know you are also a target for those evil men. Be careful. I know. So, I wish you safe journey, safe trip, journey messes. If you go tomorrow. Hmm? Thank you. Cheer up.
gonna burn this house. Yes. 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 There are some boys at the gate. Many of them, they are threatening. I, I don't know what the problem is causing a commotion, but don't panic, okay? Now, I'll take care of it. Don't panic. Hello? Commissioner? Oh yes, yes, I'm fine, I'm fine. Yes, I have a little situation. There are a lot of boys in my house, yes. Yes, they are, they are at the gate. I don't know what the problem is there. They are causing uh, issues, commotion. They're threatening to burn my house. Please send your men to my house immediately. It's urgent right now, please. All right, thank you very much. Thank you. Everything will be fine. I said, are you not going? going there. It's going to sound now. What is happening there? Ah, uh -uh. are you new in this village? We are going there to demolish the house. So we are demolish going. The house. Yes, now we are going to burn there. Fat, they are sharing money. I want to go collect my own and demolish the house. So sharing money. Let's go now. Yes, now let's my go. My brother, let me tell you that I don't have to, you know, attach myself with all these things you guys are doing. I have somewhere important to go with my father. You can run and go and meet them. Share the money. Eat the money you don't. Wait. Before also chili you. Achuazo. Wait, let me tell you. Don't no, tell you me that you don't My have brother, money. I have somewhere important. Don't collect your own money. Forget about your money. Let's go. go. I will leave you and go. Judas, Fat, I'm going. Judas, my job, my job. You are supporting to be a Igwe. Eh? The criminal is supporting. Chasing that way are you with, with policemen mm -hmm. eh? in this land. No, no, Baba, look at your father. Look at what he has done. Me, elders running in this community. Abuja Osaga, Abuja Abuja Kobo. Eh? Look at the criminal you are supporting. I don't know he kidnapped the daughter of this town. He has gone to bring policemen to chase away the protesting youths. Is that the kind of person you want to become a king? Eh? You know him? Look at your father. He's supporting a criminal. What does that make him? Is he not a criminal? No! If you want to prove your point, take your son and go there. Can the police why can't you? Break his head. Huh? Ah, look at you. Me running from police in my own town. Ah. A chief like me. No, continue supporting criminals. You want it to be the Igwe? Huh? Mm -hmm. ah? Look at what you're causing. No, go there. A police why can't you? I'm running from police. Reading 
Look at your two left leg. <laughs> you see your life and your friend's life. Modras, ritualist. <laughs> Instead of me, Sinta Ibekwe, to marry such an evil man, I better stay in my father's house and be eating white apple honorably. I told you, Kelechi, evil no de pio. Hey! All the noise you have been making. Tikana the rich man, Tikana the villainer. Have you seen where it has ended? Oh! So bad. <laughs> Do you know the letters? The elders, they are planning to banish him and burn that his house, that blood morning house. <laughs> I am very sure, my friend, that they are human's head he used in that foundation of the house. <laughs> and he has caught up with him more. Hell, such a shame. Such a shame, oh my friend. Kelechi, I told you stay away from those people. You will not listen. Do you just have any other thing to say? Are you mad? Look at you! Look at, 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 look at the way she's shaking it. You don't even have it. <laughs> Kelechi, see you! I told you! If they ask you what you are shaking, what will you tell them? You don't even have it. Look at you. <laughs> Let's see if I show you how to shake this thing, my friend. You don't even know how to shake it. <laughs> I told you you don't have it. It's, it has choked. It's choking. Be careful before they come and arrest you. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> if I didn't have a divine revelation concerning becoming king of Umudim. I wouldn't be stressing myself over this. Believe me. When I have enough money, people, enough activities to keep me happy for the rest of my life, why would I be bothering myself about this? Why? Sweetheart, do not let this weigh you down. You know what they say. Many are afflictions of the righteous. But the Lord delivered them from them all. My problem right now is my name. How do I clear my name from this mess? How? Babe, the Bible says that sorrow might endure for a night, but joy comes in the morning. People are jealous of you and would do anything just to destroy you. But you know what? God will vindicate you. Trust me. <sighs> I know this must be the handwork of Akokalia, that evil man. <sighs> he is not as guilty as Cynthia on this matter. Yes. How do you mean? <sighs> Cynthia has always seen me as an enemy. I would do anything just to hurt me. Cynthia, your friend? Yes. Well, you guys are friends. Right? I know. But she's not as good as Kelechi. I realized that of late and started putting her at arm's length. Hmm. You know, when we got married, she said a lot of things about me that got me frightened. So, dear, if you're looking for a finger to point at, look towards her direction. I believe she. Who's the key to this puzzle? Yeah, she does. <sighs> Babe, see, everything will be fine, okay? Let's calm down, all right? Darling, my love. Before you traveled, you told me that when you come back again, that we'll have a court wedding. And then you will take me to America. So why are you saying all this now? Oh, honey, nothing has changed. It's, it's just the first one. I just want to quickly rush back to the States and fix up one or two things. And 
December is just a few few months away from now. By December, I'll be back and we can... No way, Odinaka! You cannot go back to America with Tatsumi. That is not the agreement. No, honey. But your papers are not out yet. Oh, please, don't even tell me that. How can you marry me, a princess like me, and then you want to dump me here and be going and coming back from America with Tatsumi? It is not going to work, Odinaka. Honey, it's business. This is strictly business. You told me you're doing your own business. Yes, I am doing my own business. So why can't you stay back and do it through the internet? <sighs> Honey, you will not understand. I will not understand anything that will make me stay back in this town or even this country while you go back to America. Or like you want to disgrace me. You want people to mock me. What will my friends, what will my people say? Those that just, what are they going to say? Odinaka, you seem to forget that I am a princess. Which kind of wahala be this one? Me! Wahala! No, oh, honey, 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 that's, that's not how I mean it. No, how do you mean it? What are you trying to tell me? You want to fool me? Honey, can you calm down? I will not calm down! Please! I will not calm down! You're raising your I will raise my voice! Let everybody hear the nonsense that you're talking about! That I, I should stay back! Me! Adora! I, I didn't say no, you! You think I'm a fool? Do you think I'm a fool? messes with me and goes scotch free yes i'm talking about your friend if he had married me he wouldn't be going through all those things that he's going through instead he decided to dump me and married a local girl <laughs> well it's male accusation anyone can be accused oh really everybody cannot be accused when he was with me i could sniff trouble from afar and prevent it from happening you know why because i'm learned and streetwise I think some guys are just so foolish. Atigena is among them. Mm -mm. Tijana is not stupid. Uh, he is not foolish. Tijana is a good man. I know him. He's an honorable man and the best species of men I have met in this life. Says who? Story. Well, I advise you move on with your life. Because he has done the same. Did I tell you I haven't? I just heard the trending stories and commenting on it. I know my friend, Tijana. It's a minor thing he will overcome his challenges, son. I knew you would support him. I suspected you were the one who advised him not to get married to me. What? Quit it. Don't quit at me. You and your friend are very wicked, and I'm so happy he will bite the dust. Nonsense. Cynthia, Cynthia, the girl of the moment. How surprised of me bumping into you immediately I just entered this town. You look astonishing. Hmm. Who are you and why are you so happy seeing me? 
My name is Maxwell. Max for short. I'm the journalist from Scoop magazine. I'm sure you must have read about it. Yeah, of course. Scoop is very popular. Yeah. The story of how you exposed one Mr. Tegana has been everywhere. And my company sent me to interview you. And the story is going to be in the front page of the magazine. And your picture is going to be everywhere. I mean, <laughs> everywhere. Wait. Did you say... I think I'm going to be in magazine. Not just the magazine. I mean, in front page of the magazine. So, which means your picture is going to be everywhere and everybody's going to see you. <laughs> Both America, Germany, China, everywhere. Let's go somewhere so that we can settle down. So I can interview you and take proper photograph. Like, am I okay? Like, my no, dressing, no, no, my no, hair, no. is good. it... Am, oh, I, am oh, I okay whoa. like this? Wait, like, you, you... I need to fix my nails. <laughs> you are okay like this. You are okay. You are. I are you, you sure? You are, you are, you are perfect. Are you, you are, sure? You are okay. So can we go now? <laughs> my nails. <laughs> oh no 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 no! It's nice. You're good. You're good. Let's go. We should go. After you. Sure sure sure. Let's go. Thank you. <laughs> like, <laughs> I can't wait. Thank, wow. thank you. Thank you. How many times am I going to explain this to you that your papers? And your passport cannot be ready this soon. Please, just hang on. Can you just hang on a little, please, my love? Odinaka, listen to me. The only way this thing can work is for you to take me to Lagos. Rent a very good apartment for me in a very good area like, like Leki. And hey, I can stay there and be waiting for you. Not in this local village. But honey, our village is not local. We have good roads, electricity and water. Even internet. The money we we'll use in hiring a house in Lagos, we can use it to do more important things in our life. But like I so I am not important. Hey, Adora, you have suffered. You think I don't know? You promised to get your mother a car to be taken around the village, but me, your wife, the princess of Mudikido, I am not good for something better. Hey, how did I get married to this man? How did I end up with you, honey? Can you calm down? Can you, can you stop this drama, please? Odinaka, you are calling my pains drama. No, 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 you are calling my pains drama. That's not what I'm saying, honey. Then what are you saying? Fine, I'll take you to Lagos. Okay? I'll get the house and I'll furnish it to your standard, to your taste. Are you happy now? And a car. A very good car. Yes, I cannot be trekking and jumping from one taxi to, to bus. Honey, you don't... But honey, you don't have anywhere to go with a car now. Says who? Listen, is it that you get me a very good car with freezing AC or you forget about this whole thing? Ah! I cannot be riding in good cars in my father's house and then I will come to my husband's house and be trekking. Who does that? Don't even choose them. It's okay, it's okay. Okay? Would that make you happy? For now, yes. Ah, come here. Can you please? Oh, my baby girl. My sugar. Okay. It's okay. Then why why were you stressing me? Eh? Wait, you don't mind. Beautiful. Thank you. Um, this sh you should keep this a secret, so that when the magazine comes out, <clears throat> it will take everybody by surprise. Mm. 
I understand. <laughs> you see all these jealous girls in this village. <laughs> I bet you they will eat up their hearts by the time they see me in international magazine. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Thank you so you know, much. One big man or even the president of America can invite you to come and live in America. Is that possible? Very possible. You see all these Oyibo people. Eh? Once they notice a smart talent like this, they give you visa immediately. Wow. So I'm smart. <laughs> oh God, I can't wait. I can't wait. Eh? It will happen, babe. But don't forget me when the time comes. Mm, so... I will die. Eh? <laughs> How would I forget you? <laughs> One more thing. There is this man that's supposed to be the Igwe of this community. I want to interview him. Oh. Chief Akokalia. Exactly. I'll take you to him. I'm sure he would love to be in this international <laughs> magazine. <laughs> but can we go now? The earlier the better. Of course, yes. Because I'll be going back to the city this Saturday. Aww. So soon. Yes. Mm, I love to see this face in him. <laughs> <laughs> okay, because of you, I'll be coming back every now and then to mm. check up on you. Max, oh. promise me. Don't just throw it away. I promise. Uh, I promise. Okay, I promise. Come on, Max. Come on. Mm, I don't want drinks to go. I will still go. <laughs> what nonsense are you talking about? No, you mean you want to travel to America first before you send me money to get your house in Lagos? No, no, honey. I'm running low on cash. Mm. So all I'm asking for is just two weeks, honey. Mm -hmm. Two weeks and I'll send you the money you need. Odinaka, you lie. You think I'm a small girl. You want to deceive me. Listen, it's either you give me the money now, or the both of us will stay back in this village. Yes. Listen, 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 and listen for the very last time. I am tired of you. What is your problem? Since I got married to you, it's been one problem to the other. You nag, and you stress at my life. You're up here. As a matter of fact, I'm not taking you to America. Not today, not tomorrow. It is women like you that go to America and they kill their husband. As a matter of fact, you're going to remain in this village with my mother and you bear your kids here. If I am too merciful on you, when you are due, I'll bring you abroad so my children can be American citizens. What is your problem? I am sick and tired of you. For God's sake! What's this? What, Naka? Are you drunk or you're crazy? Are you blind? I am sober! <laughs> you want me, a princess, to stay back in this village for mother? Your father is not even the Igwe. You are just an ordinary girl. Look at you. The only difference is that you are, you are, you are just boastful and disrespectful. Just like your father. My father will hear of this. And I promise you, he will deal with you mercilessly. I promise you, he will deal with you. What, 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 he will deal with you. What, what, what is the meaning of this? Eh? Since I got married to you? That's also, that's also. Hey, God. Sendoka. Oh no. If you go no ka esi bo ni bi ma. Focus is here. Okoto kale. We have done our best to get the right candidate to be our igwe. But it appears the gods of our land have a different plan. Oh no. I am so so discouraged and worried about the future of this town in the hands of Akokalia. Akokalia. He has been sending emissaries to my house here. Yes, several emissaries to convince me to convene a meeting to decide on a date for his coronation since he is now the sole candidate. But I've been avoiding him. I have been avoiding him, but um, as it is now, I doubt if I can't continue to avoid him. It appears I have to surrender and do the needful. You understand me? I understand. That is why I invited you to alert you beforehand that very soon I'm going to convene a meeting to choose a date. I understand. By virtue of your position, as you know, you are not supposed to be partisan. That is my point. That is my point. 
I'm afraid, you know, I will not attend any such meeting. Please, please, please pardon me. There's not, nothing to pardon. <laughs> There's no offense there. I understand very well. I understand your position very well. It's a principled position. I understand it. Mm. Let's see how it goes. Oh, what about uh, Nemeka? How is he coping with all this? Mm. I have not seen him for a while. But we spoke on phone. And he said he was fine. It's fine, huh? Yes. I, <laughs> I hope so. <clears throat> I hope so. Hey. I hope. I really, really hope so. No, if any man. Ojoka. I know that I I rap umweza ye anje si keje umweza wal. Eh? I rap umkulu sowa tabakulu siu. More or more cold. I don't know how this just came about. I just I am confused. My dear. I am very happy to see you strong and focused. I have just come to tell you or to let you know that I do not believe the nonsense I hear about you because I know it is the handwork of the devil. Your enemies are being used by the devil to discredit you, but they must all fail in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. You see, when I remember all you did for me and the hospital, oh, the only person that remembered me when things were very, very rough for me, bad what you did for me and I used that money judiciously I was even trying to invite you to come and see things by yourself when this nonsense rumor came up man's life there will always be trying times but I believe this period will pass and God in heaven that I serve will vindicate me he must surely vindicate and protect you against the enemies Amen. and the agents of darkness Amen. Amen. thank you thank you my son Naka left you. How? He has abandoned you. How? How did he abandon you? How? <laughs> oh my god, all right, all right, all right. Calm down, calm down. Where are your things? <laughs> Solomon! Solomon! Where were you? I, I was eating. You were eating in Nege. Where were you when my daughter came in and dropped her expensive bags on the floor in her parlor? Now will you go and get those things before I redesign your face? I'm on It's alright. 
Come pull yourself together. Come, come get up. I want to die. I want to die. I want to die. Not in my house. All right, let's go inside. Let's go inside. It's okay. It's okay, sweetheart. It's okay. I don't understand this here story. The last time we spoke on phone, you said the man was preparing your papers for you to join him abroad. Now you come back with the story that he doesn't want you to join him again. I don't know for him, Daddy. He's a useless man. He doesn't love me. He wants me to go live with his useless mother in, in the village. A home me. Princess of Umudi Kingdom. God forbid. Let's go, man. <laughs> The man has discovered who you are with your bad character and he has sent you packing. See, Daddy, why are you saying all this? Are you supporting him? I'm not supporting him, but I'm telling you the truth. Mm. Before you left here, I gave you every advice I could find in the books. But of course, you would not listen. Now the bubble has burst. Listen. There's no other space in this house. Eh? That's your room. Print it out. Go and reconcile with him. Mm. I'll kill myself. Oh. I'm going to kill myself. I need to be on your head. Mm. Do you want a rope? Or a knife? Mm. We can't mother. We can't mother. Mommy! Mommy! I was saying it. You call me old names, old man, old school. What an old man sees standing. <laughs> Even when he's sitting, you cannot see it on an Iroko tree. Uh, I want old school. Old school. I know how you are. Every year. Let me see you come back here. You want to wear a dress that is not uh, of a good one. I talk to you, you say I'm an old man. Old man, I want to say, when you share work and I go in a supermarket. I have waited for you in the chair to convene this meeting, but you kept on procrastinating. That's why I decided to invite you to my house. I have suffered all manner of treachery, conspiracy. Since I declared interest in being the Igwe of this community. Well, stones, pebbles, even irons have been thrown at me for this declaration. But my God has been fighting my fight. And as they say in our local parlance, the breeze has blown. We now see that the reverend wears a trouser under the cassock. One small boy called Tigana comes with blood money. And you all start inching to his side. <laughs> I look around me. Ndoka and Okafo. They are not here. And I am not surprised. But I assure you, I will deal with them appropriately when the time comes. And the time will come soonest. Right on, <laughs> my God anointed leader. Let's go, Sully. Akokaria. Look at that. My kid and kin, all these years, if you cry, I cry. You smile, I smile. When you lead, I say, no, you lead. When you lead, the water you drink in this same community is what I drink. I have contributed more than any other person to the development of our community. And then one criminal element called Emeka Tigana comes in with blood money. You all abandoned me to follow him. On Adenoma. But. Huh? But. 
Our ancestors have their hands on this head and they have vindicated me. <clears throat> Chief Akokalea, have you invited us here to insult and humiliate us or what? Oh no. I have invited you to tell you the home truth. It is obvious, even to the blind man, that you don't like me. And you will never wish that I become the Igwe of this community. But that's a talk for another day. I have invited you, Umunen Umunan, to pick a new date and coronate me as the Igwe of this community. What are we waiting for? Look at him. Take it easy. To be a king is not a daughter. Chifaku Kalia. Chifaku Kalia. What is the matter? Nameka called me. I asked both of us to come to Chifaku Kalia's house urgently. Chifaku Kalia's house? What for? I have no idea. But he first asked me if we are part of the meeting going on there in Aqualia's house and I said no. He said we should leave whatever we are doing and come down to Aqualia's house urgently. That something very important is about to happen. Something important? Sure. And he did not tell you what is it that is about to happen? No, he did not. Yeah. But he sounded confident and urgent. In that case, let's go. I trust that young man. Any time, any day. Me too. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Please. Uh, Ako, um, Ono, I respect you so much, but it is said that a man who's been admired should not rub charcoal or sand on his face. Meaning, I am disappointed that you and Ondoka would conspire to try to rubbish Akokalia. You owe Akokalia an apology, you know. You are right. Thank God you're all here today to witness what's about to happen. I've been wrongly accused of kidnapping a little girl. I've been insulted, I've been mocked, and I've been almost ostracized from our village. I tried to plead my innocence, but nobody wants to listen to me. But I thank God for a day like this, because evil can only thrive, but for a little while. What's this nonsense all about? How dare you disrupt the meeting of Ndichi of Mudem? Because you can bribe the police? Akokalia, shut up, I'm still talking. Hey! You dare ask me, you were in waiting, to shut up? In my own house? Before my own people? What an abomination! Akokalia, shut up and sit down, I'm still talking. If you dare address me in that manner again, I will strike! Oh. You cannot do that in my presence. We are here at the instance of the Inspector General of Police. We have investigated the case of Kidna, and possible murder of one Ozioma Adichie. Now we have come out with something the whole community would like to see and hear. Sergeant! Sir! Bring the suspect.
saw the inevitable punch. He was here with some policemen. Is that a police van? Yes. Jesus, I have phobia for police. Mommy, I, I, I think they're over there. Hmm? Yes. Let's go. Let's go. Hey. You sit there. Do you know this man? Yes. Can you tell us his involvement in the kidnap of one Ozama? It was Chivagukalia that asked me to bring out my friend so that they would kidnap her and I would spread the fake news that they would say it's Tigana that did it. How much did Chief Akukalia pay you to do the job? 50k. That's a lie. Lie from the pit of hell. Where and when did I meet you to make such preparations? Say that now, I... Hey, there's no need for this thing. We have done our investigation. We have it before we arrested her and other culprits. Yes. Sergeant. Sir. Bring Corporal Maswa. It was that night. He sent his boys to bring the morning. And they brought it. I'm sorry. What? What are we going to do? Do what? Mommy, this is all your fault. My fault? You never advised him. Oh, you should have advised him first. Are you not his wife? You are his daughter. And you look like him. No, I don't look like him. You won't search again. Are you mad? Look what you did. What did I say? Hey, 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 wait for me. Kokalia, I hope you have seen this young man before. Cynthia's new boyfriend he came to you to interview you. Uh, he's an investigative police officer. He has everything on record. The deal between you, your dogs, and Cynthia. All the midnight discussion and all that, he has it on record. Chief Kokalia, you knew very well that Cynthia was envious of a film man for getting married to Tigana, and you cashed into him to do what you did. Um, by the way, where is the Ozioma? The girl that was kidnapped. She's somewhere. Where is so Where is the somewhere? Somewhere in the Where? We want to know. The next village. Is she alive or dead? She's alive. <laughs> Good for you. Tifa Kokalia, we are under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. For anything you say here may be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to an Anthony. Now, move. This is amazing. So this is what has been happening behind the scenes. Oh, you're such a wonderful young man. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The gentle squires of the leopard is no cowardice. Let's go. Let's go. Let us follow up on this. <laughs> 